I survived 100 days on a straight line in Minecraft Hardcore. There's barrier blocks to my left and my right, so for this challenge, I'm truly locked in. The world is a very limited size, nearly zero resources, and nothing spawns in. It's so tricky that if I want to go to the nether, I have to break the portal to enter and leave. So much fun. The journey you're about to watch is a tricky one. I have to calculate every single move and resource I use, as nothing on here is unlimited and I can barely make any farms, especially if I want to get villagers or to conquer the nether. If you enjoy this movie and want to see more, 30,000 likes and I'll release another 100 days movie. It'd also mean a lot if you'd subscribe too. If you'd like to see bloopers and funny moments of this movie, you should go subscribe to my second channel. And if you want to see sneak peeks at future movies or to talk to me, you should go follow my Twitter. Now, here's me surviving 100 days on a straight line in Minecraft Hardcore. Enjoy. Oh, don't be thunder, please. Please, I, I really don't need that right now. And oh my god, it's finally grown. Oh. Okay, so it doesn't end. <laughs> this is actually by far the hardest challenge that I've done. Yes, we got one bone meal. Ooh, no way. I right, hello, beautiful. Hopefully I can find diamonds very soon. <laughs> Has it always been this easy to get so much gold in here? Yeah, just stand right there, bud. Yeah, thank you. So I definitely think before we get back to our portal, we trade more. Uh, Oh, that's cool. I can't even move left and right if I want to. Oh, no. <laughs> and hello, beautiful. Uh, for once, I think I actually will take all of this because I have a feeling this isn't going to be an easy uh, challenge at all. And let's say, oh, here's the challenges. Survive for one day and survive for seven days. Well, I think I'm going to be able to uh, complete one and two insanely easy. And so far, everything else is basically how I'm going to play. Another fun thing that I, uh, I found out I can't cheat and look to, uh, you know, the outside, so I can't, you know, uh, see anything down there, so th th this should be fun. First off, I think we just go around and actually explore this land, see what we have. Is my number one priority right now? Sheep. Oh, oh my, wow. This is very interesting, seeing just, you know, only a single line in the land. This is uh, definitely new. Okay, let's make a boat. Oh, no, can I not use boats? No, I can't place it at all. Oh, okay. I hate this. I hate this so much. I mean, at the very least, we're getting wood, so... Okay, so I'm starting to come to the conclusion that uh, this world doesn't end. So I've been finding out, so I wonder if I should just start making a base. <laughs> It almost really does not seem like it's worth it to travel. Oh, you is there something good for me over here? I really wish I had a water bucket. That, I, I would not be opposed to that if you just wanted to give me one. Uh-oh. Um, mm, I think I've run into an issue. I, I think I went too far. <laughs> Okay, so we're a lot more limited on space than uh, what I was originally thinking. This is such a rough start. Now, the next thing that I'm really curious about, because I don't think I'm going to be finding any sheep, uh, can mobs spawn on here? Oh, please tell me spiders can spawn. Oh no, I don't think they can because I couldn't even place down a boat. Well, I'm back at my spawn, and in case you're wondering, it... Looks like nothing will spawn. Okay, so this changes the game plan a lot. Okay, so this will come to a surprise to you. I'm starving and I really need food. Uh, I can't make a fishing rod. So first off, desperately need another shovel for this part. And then I do have a hoe and I have dirt right here with some water. The one issue is that I don't have a water bucket, so I can't exactly make this farm a lot longer. How Ever. If we go right here and do one, two, three, four, I think these four should always be hydrated. And then now I can actually start to grow wheat on this. And I'm uh, hoping that it grows fast because I am probably going to starve to death soon. I, I don't know if I should be moving. What we can do, which this might help, is we'll make a composter. So I'll boom right there. And then, you know, don't need the flowers. Uh, I don't need that many saplings you know we might be able to get away with that and that that's looking like everything okay <laughs> can you grow fast please well that's growing we're not gonna sprint anymore and we're just gonna go check out this direction tee hee hoo hoo i really regret sprinting down that entire side of the line okay so i never thought i'd hear myself say this but i'm actually totally okay with finding a lot of flowers or i guess i can also use a lot of the birch saplings because you know this wood is ugly oh don't be thunder please please Please, I, I really don't need that right now. Huh? 
Um, okay, so I'm basically soft locked until I find a water bucket. Okay, well, uh, that was a fun journey. Let's go back home. <gasps> we have some progress now. Oh, it grew a little bit. Woo! Okay. I need to make a mine shaft. Oh, here we go. Okay, so now if we want to make a very easy mine shaft, just use a trap door. So now I can go down like here, and then I just place a trap door like this, and then I can get into my mine shaft, and then. I can, you know, just put it right back up and continue walking. Okay. We have to be very creative. And I am trying my hardest to be creative on here and make everything work. I have to be very careful to not mess up whatsoever. At the very least, it kind of feels like I'll never have to worry about lighting in here. Because nothing is spawning. It's been 84 years and all I've really seen is stone. Oh, <gasps> yes. Something different. Coal. Oh, we might have found a lot. Please, I'm so desperate. I desperately need some kind of iron please we're so close oh wait i might be able to be smart um okay wait I, I need to think this through very well though so i can skip this water and i can put dirt here and oh wait i might be able to make a bigger farm <gasps> Ooh, I think I should be safe to do that. I don't think me placing blocks here would ruin anything. So now we can go four, but then this block is getting these four. So then we can go one, two, three, four. And then this water block is getting all of those. Let me go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, and then boom. This now covers the entire lake. So I can, you know, walk through it faster. And then if I need to, I can still swim down here. So I'm not blocking anything. So I think we're good. I think we're safe with all of that. Uh, the hardest part, I, okay, I did not want to jump on that. So what I think we can do as well, since I really don't care for birch, like at all, I can use birch for the trap door which we then place like right there so it doesn't affect the water but i can still walk across it so that way i'm not jumping onto any of my crops perfect give me my hoe and okay i got five seeds so it's not the worst oh man we are struggling <laughs> beautiful my idea worked okay sick i love it when everything just works now if only these would grow faster please <laughs> so while that all grows i don't want to go far away from this so i think I think it's time that I start uh, utilizing the mine a little bit better. So I think like around here, we can just start mining in a straight line across. And then here's where trap doors come in handy. So I can continue the staircase just like this. Boom, we're completely fine. And then I can walk through them and boom, I can go right back to mining. Surely there has to be iron somewhere, please. So then for the rest of the day, I just got to mining. I would go down two blocks, make a straight line, go down two blocks. I was just really worried about hitting my farm in the beginning, so I, I was very careful towards the top. The only things that I was finding was stone, stone, some more stone. Oh, also I got some coal and some copper. And then once the sun was going down and I was getting really worried that I wasn't going to find anything today, I found iron and I only found two of them. So I still need more iron. And then starting off day four, I got right back to mining. I went back to the line, kept on doing it. And then I just went to the next one. And then I found kind of a cave in a sense, if you can call it that. My first goal was just to go all the way to the bottom just to see if there was anything special down there. Once I noticed that there wasn't anything special down there, I went up and then I noticed that, oh my God, there, there's iron. I'm saved. I can finally make the bucket. So I went, collected those, noticed there was nothing else in the cave. I went back to my house smelted all of the iron there i just waited for it because i can't really do anything else made the bucket i went and got water so i can now go explore the rest of the land if i had enough food and then with nothing else to do i just sat in my composter and waited out the night we have a huge problem right now as you can see in the bottom right corner uh i have one and a half hunger left and um if that reaches zero i die I think, I don't know. I don't really care to test that out. Uh, so I, I kind of can't do anything until these grow. I think this is fully grown, but I'm really scared scared to hit it oh it actually is grown okay that's good uh you might be grown okay good you are you are uh, i know for a fact that's not and now i can extend this i have 
too weak. Um, I might as well. I don't know why I also didn't do this. Uh, wasn't my smartest move. Um, yeah, I have carrots and potatoes. Might as well go and start growing these. And I can't lie, I really wish that I was joking when I say this. I now have one hunger left. Um, I can't play. Like, I, I'm now at the point where I can't even move anymore or else this is going to kill me. I, I It's kind of getting to the point where I have to wait for multiple of the wheat to actually fully grow. And then I can go down there, quickly harvest them, quickly make myself bread, and then I'll stay alive. So, um, I can't do anything today and most likely tomorrow as well. So, this should be fun. So day six and I'm still sitting inside of all my fecal matter inside of this tub. My knees are getting weak and my arms are getting heavy and there's spaghetti on my sp <laughs> So luckily today, uh, nothing still has fully grown. I still cannot move whatsoever. If I move one block, then I'm going to go down to half of a hunger bar now. And I'm starting, you know, kind of getting worried, but I'm just getting really bored because I want these to grow so I can start playing again. It's day three and I'm now starting to see things in my eyes. I also wanted to test out what would happen if I just go Mach 27 in a circle non-stop inside of my tub just to see what would happen with the fecal matter inside of my pants. Also while doing this test, I seem to have increased my chances of carpal tunnel and arthritis in my hand by 37%. <sighs> and oh my god, it's finally grown. Oh, oh my god, finally I can play. Yes. Oh my god, dude, even the carrots are grown. Uh, don't think that's grown. And then you know what? We're just gonna make this over here uh, also wheat. You know, we're, we're, we'll leave this as potatoes, this as carrots. Oh my gosh, I can finally move around and play uh i don't think those two are grown but i can finally make one piece of bread Woo! okay wow and that really did nothing <laughs> uh, that really did like nothing at all for me um okay i think we're gonna chance it we're gonna go on another journey maybe we'll find some seeds or something i don't know maybe we'll find like a chest with steak in it and then this is how far i made it last time so now instead of having to bridge all the way down there what oh okay, god yeah. Ooh, okay you scared me there for a second we might have something useful down here maybe uh okay no <laughs> But we now have another tree. We might as well just go make a bridge at this point. So I guess I really didn't need to make a bucket. Oops. So uh, collected a little bit of blocks. This should be good. And then we just slowly bridge our way down. Perfect. Please. Okay, good, good. Oh. <gasps> Ooh, we have a bush. That means more seeds, maybe. Okay, cool. Love you too. Interesting tree. Please lead to something good, please. Please. Oh, wait. Oh, I can actually get apples from this. It also just hit me. Can I grow trees in this world? Uh, oh no. I might have to be like incredibly careful with what I use my wood on now. Oh, that also means that I have limited tools. But at least I have an apple. Nom, 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 nom. But at the very least, we are finding a lot of trees, so I might be good on wood. Oh, God. Do I make another crafting table on the... Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, well, it's looking like the land is super far and long, so we might not be in too much trouble. Oh, thank God I can even swim in here. So another thing I'm noticing is that fish don't spawn in these waters, so I actually think that there is no mob capable of spawning in this world. Oh, underwater cave, maybe some good, oh, oh. Okay, so now here's the little trick is to put, oh my God, it doesn't work. Oh God, it doesn't work, doesn't work, doesn't work. Okay, I thought I was being smart there and showing you guys something cool, but never mind. So now the other way to actually get an air pocket is to dig about two blocks this direction. Uh, quickly get your water bucket and do the exact same thing again. Okay, don't die. Please let me get oxygen. Please, 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 please. Now we can actually get that iron. Uh, that was one iron. I, I did all of that for one iron, okay. <gasps> Oh, I think I can actually do a lot with kelp, but I don't know if I can use it as a fuel source for a furnace, but I'm pretty sure I can eat kelp. I've never actually done that before, but I'm pretty positive I can. <gasps> oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, I definitely need to get this and I get it before I start drowning. Oh, okay. Then I believe if I come here, put dirt there. Yes. Okay. 
So now I'm just in my mole era. Answer is looking like no, unless... Nope, nope, it is definitely a no. Okay. <gasps> okay, so it doesn't end. <laughs> And it looks uh, like I just hit this edge of the world. Okay, so we don't have much to work with. I almost want to say that this map is about 2,000 blocks wide. And I believe I just collected every single tree. Okay, well, uh, I guess we're now we just make it back home. Oh, finally. Oh, I think I'm finally getting close to the house. Oh my goodness, yes, we're finally home. Now... No, no, that's not fully grown. No, never mind. Okay, not even gonna test that. Now, before I even try anything with the kelp, we should probably first go down here and grow it. Now, hopefully kelp doesn't take a long time to grow. I've Again, I've never tried this before, so uh, it's gonna be a learning process for both of us. And then I'll put the rest of the seeds over here. Oh, that's fully grown. <gasps> yes. And then now we can make some bone meal or not. I guess we'll just put down that one, see if it even grows. But I, I really have no faith in that whatsoever. This might be all of the wood that I have for the rest of the movie. Or at least until I make it to the nether. But I, again, I don't even know how I'm, I'm gonna get that far. Okay, now while everything grows and we try to get more food, I guess we can now come back down here. And since that led into a giant cave, I'm going to assume that, you know, if I dig at any point, Point right here it's also going to lead into that cave so we might as well just continue this route <laughs> this is actually by far the hardest challenge that i've done and it's also even harder to get content <laughs> oh yay copper Woo! yeah i love copper yay <gasps> yes Ooh, you are actually amazing. Ooh, I like you. Okay, and we're now entering the deep slate area. So around here, I should hopefully get lucky enough and find lava or diamonds. So I mean, technically, if I just find a lava pool, I can actually go to the nether. And that'll make this tremendously easier. But then it also gets rid of the challenge. And I don't know if I want to make it that easy just yet. Okay, then before going into the mines, oh my goodness. Oh man, I'm getting spoiled. I just got two more wheat. Oh my goodness. And nothing else has grown. Okay, cool. Tree still hasn't grown, which I don't think it ever will. However, I can eat one more bread. Man, I am getting so spoiled. <laughs> okay, so we might be low enough down here that we're not gonna hit the cave, but I think we still will. But I think we should actually mine this direction because we might be at diamond level in here wow this is really painful to mine with just a uh, stone pickaxe actually you know what no 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 i think we're still too high up and give me these back these are very valuable to me now why does there have to be so much copper please literally any other ore would be so much more greatly appreciated oh at least we're getting close to diamond level <laughs> you can use deep slate for a stone picket wait what i have no idea how i've never known that oh yeah that's good to know ah why hello there my beauties oh my god and more of you have grown oh my oh i'm so proud of you i can't uh, uh, let's test it oh it is oh okay good good potatoes are going i don't think that's fully grown just yet i'm not even gonna touch that we'll try it out tomorrow and yes we got one bone meal Woo! with this i can fully grow you yes oh man i almost got spoiled there i was almost able to make two bread but now oh my god i'm fully healed and I have a full hunger bar. We're making progress. At some point, I should probably make a staircase for all of that. It'd probably save on hunger and time so I don't have to keep jumping up all of it, but then I'd, I'd have to mine out the roof again. Yeah, never mind. I just talked myself out of it. I swore my life. I just heard lava. Am I going insane? I swear I just heard lava. It was really faint. It's that direction. Oh my God, I found lava. Oh, this can be huge. Oh, that might lead to lava. Actually here, just so we're safe. Oh my God, we found lava. Oh, oh my gosh, we actually have lava. Okay, if the gravel doesn't get rid of all of it. Okay, I need to go get rid of the water first. Oh. Ooh, and wow, you grow really fast. Okay, that's incredibly nice. So we have 11, so now... Oh my god, don't try, don't, no, 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 no. Oh my god, I took damage, dang it. Okay, we quickly just grow some more down here. I never realized there was coal right there. Oh my god, no way. They grow in just a one block area? Okay. Uh, The downside, I didn't get any saplings from that. Oh. 
ever. We'll do one there. And I think if we just go up like four blocks in between it, and we just keep planting trees like this. Okay, so that's all the trees. That's incredible. I didn't know that trees would grow in that restricted of an area. I wonder if it's because of the barrier blocks. So maybe the saplings don't realize it's that tiny of an area, maybe? I don't know. Ooh, hi, beautiful. Oh, and look at that. Oh, I have food on backup. Oh my goodness. Okay, now we're gonna come into another issue. Oh, don't tell me. Oh, don't tell me. I only found like two or three things of lava. Oh no. So with the portal, um, you kind of can't enter it because you see, uh, <laughs> Uh, I can't go left or right, you know, and um, so for me to actually enter the nether and, you know, always leave it, um, I need a diamond pick and then I always have to break out of the portal. I, I have to break either two obsidian on the sides or I break one on top or bottom, blah, 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 whatever. And I also don't know if I come back through the portal, can I actually break the portal and start mining out the obsidian or I, I, don't, I don't know. <laughs> it might be a very short movie if I go through that portal okay maybe you are done growing okay nope you are not done growing cool well that sucks i just wasted that but that's a problem for future me oh no uh, i think i only have three lava right there but even though this is painfully slow doing all of this i can't lie it's actually really fun uh you know having a humongous challenge for once <laughs> and having to actually calculate everything please be more than three. Oh, we might have four. <laughs> Ooh, we got another one growing own. I think I can be quick enough with this. Okay, nice, nice. Not the worst. Why, hello, beautiful. Ooh, am I gonna be lucky and have a fifth? No. Okay. Uh, this might be all the lava right there. Oh, <gasps> it's not. There's more. Oh, I just heard it. Okay, okay. Okay, so we're not out of luck just yet. Alrighty, and now just go. Oh, water! Oh, beautiful. And then what we're gonna have to do for the portal is I have to keep making a staircase. <laughs> That's the only way to get around it, you know, so we can, can uh, continue on. Please don't, please don't, please don't, please. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Oh, I'm so stupid. Okay, at least it only ruined one. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. Uh we'll we'll leave that right there just for protection. Oh, okay, yeah. That time you didn't want to go all the way down there. Cool, yeah. Love you too, bud. And carrots are almost done. Ooh. Ooh, and you're done. Ooh. Okay, nice. Now I got two. Coo, coo, kachoo. Okay, so now for this lava. I'm gonna. Oh, yep, right there. Okay. Oh my god. It's. Oh, okay. Nope, nope. More than one. <gasps> okay, that's good. That's good. Okay. We might be able to make a lot of the portal with this. Beautiful. The carrots are now done. Oh, I have another food source. Nom, 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 So they still grow on the outside of the barrier blocks, but then, except for some reason, those aren't. Okay, now they are, but then they just disappear. Ah. Oh. Okay, and now I don't think that can ruin my farm over there. Okay, and then one side is now done, and then we'll just leave the water right here. Now, just to speed up things just a little bit, I went back down to my little lava pool area, kept getting lava. I would then go back to my portal, and I kept on building it, which I won't lie. I thought I was going to finish the entire thing today, but uh, th this takes a lot of work because of how long that I have to run. And then as I was, you know collecting lava and hoping that it wasn't going to run out because it just it's not looking good. I can't finish the portal yet because I don't have a diamond pick, you know, and I, I do have to break out of the portal every single time that I want to go in there. So uh, every single trip, I have to make sure it's actually worth it. I also don't have any armor and contrary to popular belief, um, <laughs> the nether is dangerous. Right, it first up, has anything fully grown for, uh, for me at all? Anything fully grown? No. Okay. A good thing though, yesterday, I got more carrots. So we're finally starting to stock up on some kind of food. And I just saw both of you grow. Hello. Would you guys like to uh, fully grow as well? Ooh, and hello, new bread. Now, even though I can't go to the nether just yet without causing issues for myself in here, we might as well put everything that we need for the nether portal right here at the nether portal. Okay, so with that all done, are you 
fully grown? You are. Okay, sick. Oh, man, I was not certain of that whatsoever. And let's go and stay on top of the trees. If I could be lucky and get some apples, that would be greatly appreciated. Or a sapling so I can continue growing trees. Uh, this is starting to worry me. <gasps> okay, good, good. We got one. Okay, so never mind. I might be limited on wood just because I can't get saplings. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, now we have uh, a little bit more on our pick. Time to go mining, and I am not excited. Ooh, now I can start eating potatoes. Alrighty. <sighs> Hopefully I can find diamonds very soon. <laughs> now, as soon as I got down to the bottom of my mine, I just went down a little bit more till I thought I was at a diamond level. And then I just started to dig. And then almost immediately I found some redstone. And then I remembered, oh yeah, even if I find diamonds, uh, I kind of need an iron pick. So uh, it doesn't really matter if I even find them. Then after that, I just kept tunneling and I kept finding a lot of these dark gray diamonds. And wow, it was so profitable and so amazing today. Now to start off the morning, I smelt to the three iron ore that I have left. So, oh man, we were cutting things very close. Now, once I made the iron pick and two more stone pick axes, I went back down to the mine and... Wow, this was just really uneventful. I did manage to mine my way into like a bubble cave, I guess we can call it. But for the most part, I didn't find anything today other than even more dark gray diamonds. So finally, after hiking for like four minutes, I made it back to the edge of the mine and then Within like 30 seconds of mining, I found five diamonds. And then I just wanted to double check and make sure that I got all the diamonds here. So I mined above me, I mined in front of me, and then I mined below me, finding two more diamonds. So now I have seven total. Ah, beautiful. And we made progress and I need to get organized. Oh, that took forever. Okay, so before we go into the nether, I need to make plans because I'm very scared. <laughs> We're definitely going to need to kill some hoglins in there. I honestly think this is probably going to be as good of a stack of food that I'm going to get. I think I know how to make the portal, but this isn't going to be easy. Okay, first up, I think this is probably the easiest way to get into here and still be able to reach this. I think what I have to do is put the water here, pick up that lava, which I can't reach. Okay, now I can. And I think I just have to be faster than oh wait i need to go make a flint and steel so cool here's my last iron ingot either this is probably when the movie is going to start ending because things are going to go very wrong in here or this is going to be a really fun start so put the water there pick up that you can't do anything there now that i'm in here i think if i put you there your obsidian yes okay so this is my uh the problem that i was talking about um yeah this is why i needed the diamond pick i uh, i am now completely stuck in here and then if i light you okay yes yes we can actually go for the love of god be a good spawn oh yes 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 it's a good spawn okay phew because i just remembered i didn't bring any blocks with me at all first off for me just for some nice protection i have to have a bucket of lava so now if i see any hoglins and pick ones i could just put this down catch them on fire and run away <laughs> also let's gather up some of you oh i should have brought in a crafting table with me okay we desperately need to find one of the forests in here so now if i collect a lot of you very slowly over time if i collect enough i can make gold bars and then i can make golden armor so i'm not naked in here also no sprinting but this is definitely a very scary place to be right now. What I can also do is try and farm zombified piglins, but that can go very, very wrong. Okay, nice and safe. No problems. No problems. Especially the sooner I make golden boots, the safer we are. It's looking nice in here. Has it always been this easy to get so much gold in here? Must have had a really lucky spawn. Okay. Now, this is why I gathered lava. Yeah, stay right there, buddy. Thank you so much. And that's how I'm going to be doing every single fight in here. <laughs> it's the absolute safest way. And man, do I love it. And then normally I would be like 
ecstatic about finding all this glowstone. There's really no points me collecting this whatsoever because I don't need any form of light in the world, but might as well. I don't know. Maybe I'll be surprised at me like, wow, I actually wish I had glowstone right now. And since it's so easy, <gasps> I am so happy I decided to collect it. Okay, good. Dude, everything is going correct in here. Okay. Just don't jinx anything. Do not jinx anything. Pretty please, no lava up here. Can I get lucky enough? Just not, not to grab a lot, but you know, just to grab a couple logs. Whoa. Wait, what? Am I, am I going crazy? I swore in my life I just saw a hoggle in there. Did I not? Uh, okay. Please don't break the entire tree. Thank you. Okay, with these four log or logs. Yeah, wait, log. why did I think that was wrong? <laughs> But now, I did hear one. I just don't see one. You can't get over here, right? Okay, good. Yeah, you just stay right there. Don't kill me. Yes. Harrison, give me your food. Give me your sustenance. Okay, this is kind of awkward. I thought you were going to die a lot faster. You're making this really awkward. Like, it, it really doesn't have to take that long. You, you can... <gasps> Okay, give me one second. Okay, very quickly now. Uh, you. Armor. Beautiful. Wow, we actually almost made an entire thing of armor. Of course, this is not going to last me, like, any time whatsoever. However, hey, you know, at least I'm a little bit more protected. And because of this lovely donation from our friend. <gasps> oh, we have four. Okay, uh, I'm going to save all of that because that doesn't heal for anything. And that heals for a lot. Also, I have 35 glowstone. Okay, beautiful. Even though I'm only missing a helmet let's continue collecting gold oh my god oh jesus you're so loud go away what how did you dodge no there you go beautiful beautiful why is this gas coming over here go away please okay we are now on to the iron pick okay so far all good okay now you're not gonna get angry at me for collecting this right because i know you guys hate it when i collect gold okay we're still good not running over here okay very lovely next thing they don't attack you if you use lava because you know they don't register it as you so uh, we're just gonna get rid of them every single time they're close to us not taking any chances 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 i just let myself on fire Okay, are they updated? They didn't do that before. Oh my God, please, please just get out of fire. Just stop, just stop. Just put yourself out. Put yourself out any day now. Hi, yeah, I'm not leaving any of you alive anymore because why did you, oh my God. God. Oh, yes. 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 Collect the food for me. The only downside, uh, where did the, oh, you. Yeah, uh, they don't drop cooked pork chops, which kind of sucks. Hi, are you angry at me or? Oh my God, I hear one. Oh God, hi. Where, where did the hoglin die? I just, I just want the food and I'll be out of your hair if you have any. Don't mind me. I'm, I'm doing nothing. Oh, yes. Yes. That actually wasn't even my fault. That wasn't even my doing. There you go. Get more gold. I'm starting to think they didn't even kill that hoglin. So I have one right here. Are you the one that they attacked? Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Yes. There we go. Yes, yes. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, right into there. Yes. There we go. Right into that one. Yes. There we go. Okay, now any time that you want to die is a good time for me. Okay, thank you. Woo, okay. And we got three more pork chops from that. I am quite literally playing with fire. You know, like I am quite literally playing with death. Now, let's just go right into here. Dig you down. And then we place you. And. And I now have full armor. Oh, okay, this is going nice. I'm still gonna collect the gold just because I feel obligated to at this point. Hi. No, 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 no. Don't, don't. No. Okay, thank you. Oh, not bad. Okay, so I got arrows from that, which isn't the worst. I wonder if I keep killing you guys, can one of you drop me your crossbow? Pretty please. Thank you. Come on. Drop it. Uh, I think I shouldn't have put my lava there. I probably deleted the crossbow. Hello there. You're not the piglin that I need, but hey, you can go and say hello to the last one. Are you a baby? No, oh, that is not a baby. You are definitely not my baby. No! Dang it. Oh, I knew I kept it there too long. I need my sustenance. Hello, are there any more oversized 
KFC and chicken anywhere? I don't know why I said chicken. I'm, they're pigs. Jesus. This place is almost as massive as your forehead. And I am not going to explore any of it. Why are you being friends? Are you guys making out? Oh, yo, what up? Hey, did you come here to donate your crossbow to me? Oh, hey, you better watch out, bud. Okay, you're you're almost walking into Wow, you are brave. And for that, uh, here is your prize. Give me your crossbow. Give me something. Oh, okay, dang. Okay, you were really weak. Crossbow? Crossbow? <sighs> Please go away. Please go away. Go away. Oh my God. Oh, dude, why was he running at me like that? Oh my God. I thought he wanted to kill me. Oh, like I'm, I'm pretty positive without any armor, like actual armor. He would too shot me. Yum. Um, nom, 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 nom. I won't lie. I, I don't know what I'm doing here right now. <laughs> I'm going to just running back and forth. I really don't know what I'm you know, doing. Uh, I, uh, God, I, uh, I really don't want to do this, but you know what? Here, let, let's go check this out. Uh, not feeling comfortable about this. No. I also have no idea how to get back to my portal. Okay, I hear you, but I don't see you. Oh, them. There you go. I'm sure you guys will like that. Uh, I know you're gonna die before the lava disappears, but oh well. At least I don't have to worry about you. Ooh, do you have a crossbow for me? Hi. Oh, you do have a crossbow. Oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah. Did you drop it? Nope. Okay, well, that was deserved. Can't I get iron boots? from piglins it'll be enchanted with soul speed but i don't remember if it was iron or if it was gold i just saw a hog going over here and i have no idea where they went okay there you are <gasps> no 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 get away from me get away from me <laughs> <You know? laughs> go away oh, oh yes oh thank you thank you for more food you 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 you, can you give me those enchanted iron boots? Or a fire charge? I guess that also works. I'll actually take leather. I, I actually don't mind that. Thank you. Uh, gravel? Yep, yep. Don't really need that. I, I have a lot of uh, dirt back at home. I will take that, though. I love that. Okay, not the worst. And another fire charge. Okay. Uh, ooh, thank you for the arrows. And I don't know what you just gave me, but thank you. Okay. I'll let you live. I'll be generous just this one time. Can make four more, though. So we can go and test our luck one last time. Iron boots, iron boots, iron boots, iron boots, or spectral arrow. That also works, I suppose. Can you give me something to shoot? No, not soul sand, something to shoot. It's a different S word. Same with you suck. I I'm sorry, this is part of the management. They, they told me I have to do this for uh, any pickling that gives me a bad trade. Yeah, that wasn't even meant for you. You walked into that one. You just accepted the crossfire. How did I get over here? Would you like to make it easy to get out of here oh wait before i go uh cool cool i i have three awesome oh no oh no oh. you're sending me mixed signals here are you coming over here to fight me or are you just running away come here come here i need you to like specifically this block right here please right here okay i no 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 oh my god oh my god oh you little wait but i i still want the food i put in all that hard work of throwing a bucket on you yeah uh-huh yep i know uh, this is this hurts me more than it hurts you yep i know you you forced me to do it i, I didn't even want to kill you thank you ah oh, this is so weird to actually have food for once it's like i just got my first job and i can go and buy fast food whenever i please why am i scared to go up here why why do i feel like there's something bad up here oh hey look there's something somewhat bad up here hi it's me again oh get this little okay wait 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 just one second okay there we go sorry i'm the one that <laughs> Get away from me. Oh, no, 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 no. Dang it. Ah, uh, I'm just as disappointed as you. I wanted that food. Oh, God. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, at that point, if you if you burn up the food in there, that's entirely your fault. Okay, I removed it pretty fast. No, 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 no. Don't touch. Don't touch the merchandise, please. Look, no touch. Thank you. Okay, we're up to 12. Also, how did that hoglin do like half a heart to me? <laughs> Am I a lot tankier than I thought? Oh, uh, okay. Well, there goes all that meat. Oh, <gasps> maybe. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, oh, 
Can I still get it? You you can die now. What are you? You freak? I like to test my luck way too much. Oh my god, there's another one. Oh no, that was just a baby big one. No, you tricked me. You tricked me. You tricked me. No, 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 no. You you did the little swap a Uh, yes, it didn't burn. Okay, if I'm being honest, we're probably good to head home, and that's also mainly because I have no idea where home is. One thing that I do know though is that I want to get over here and collect all of these mushrooms. Now all. All that I need to do is just make a wooden bowl and I need to find the brown mushrooms. And then I have a little bit more food. I'm just trying to extend my food bank as much oh, yes, as I can. So I don't have to come back here and play with lava buckets and hoglins again. And then I might be able to grow these, but I don't, I don't know. I don't know if I uh, want to attempt that. Also because I don't really have any bone meal. Ooh, but I do have gold. Oh my God. Okay. Uh, yep. I meant to do that. Good thing I can heal. We just got a whole lot of gold. Oh, hi. Why? What? Also, I'm still very surprised with just how strong gold armor is. Yeah, just stand right there, bud. Yeah, thank you. No, nope. Mm -mm, nope. Where did I go? I don't know. Now you can't shoot me. Hello. Oh, hi. I shoot. Or stay right there. Stay right there. Ow. No, don't shoot me. Shoot yourself. <laughs> I, I don't think I was ever up here though please sir i want a gps oh god okay i didn't mean to fall out so wait, i actually think i was down there okay somewhere flat so my oh wait wait you were that oh sweet you dropped it still okay why was he that weak that was two ticks of damage from lava okay yes yes i remember this oh my wow if i had an rv and i was into camping i would be going as static right now with all these mushrooms that joke is probably going to fly over about 99 percent of people that watch this movie oh my god that's terrifying how fast your limbs move when you sprint oh hi hello Oh, God, that is disgusting. So I have 52 reds, but I kind of need a little bit more brown. Oh, okay, buddy, I'm trying to talk here. Kind of need a few more browns, you know? Uh, kind of too many red mushrooms. Brown mushrooms, yes. I swear I'm trying to find my way back home. I just get distracted incredibly easily. And you are really trying to catch me. Okay, shoot me. Shoot me. Do something. Shoot at me. Or come in close so I can hit you. <laughs> okay, well, that was fun. Ooh, we got 38 now. Hell. Hello. So I definitely think before we get back to our portal, we trade more. Uh, I still have no idea where my portal is is ah portal cool i love it how i always randomly find it <laughs> okay so with our portal right there now i would really like to find some piglins oh piglins oh piglins where art thou piglin have i ever mentioned to you just how much i loathe you show me pew pew me fire lay waste akuna matata you're lucky i don't have a bow i'm, I'm literally i'm right in front of you there you go <laughs> don't tell me i need to run all the way back to that forest to find some more piglins totally forgot i had that mod installed that's actually really cool not gonna make it though but you know it's cool oh wow cool i finally found some and it's two baby ones awesome cool okay even though i really don't want to let's just run back to the forest collect some more brown mushrooms collect more gold find us a piglin or two and now we trade can i get you down here bud down here please as you make 500 quadrillion sounds okay please i need iron nuggets so badly please okay iron nuggets i hate you i, mm, I mean come here god you people make it so difficult to not light you on fire yes yes please come over here please come here i mean i'll take it it's just you know i doubt i'll ever be able to use it because i don't think i'm ever gonna make an anvil but thank you <gasps> no no i will kill you if you do not take that off i am i'm going to kill him no uh-uh oh and you just dropped more yes okay first we need to get rid of you guys because you're actually dangerous to me don't don't you dare i swear don't you dare ruin that armor he asked for it that was not my fault okay quickly 
Okay, good, good. It didn't even take damage. Okay. I think I kind of want to keep the crossbow for once in my life. Oh my god, what is that noise? Oh my god, stop doing that. Please stop doing that. Please stop doing that. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Dude, why are you guys making so much noise? And then we go around and clean up after ourselves. I uh, don't want to litter. Honestly, yeah, we don't need the potato. Okay, so soul speed one. We have soul, soul speed two. I don't think I'm ever going to use that, though. So I don't know if I should just throw it away or keep it. But at least we now have six iron ingots. So, you know, I have to make a new iron pick. Actually, no, no. We'll use the diamond pick, you yeah. know. I doubt I would use it all up before the end of the movie. I, yeah. Can you drop your crossbow so I can repair mine? What, think about me here, please. Okay. There was one more back here. You can't hide from him. I can smell you. And you don't even have a crossbow, okay? You are incredibly decked out. Like, you have a lot of armor. And you don't drop anything. Okay. Do I need to hit them first and then light them on fire? Okay, I was able to make one more golden ingot. Don't run from me. You're making this trade. It better be good. It, that is not good. Okay, well, hitting them doesn't change anything. So, okay. Ah, two. And then I just want to do one last pass. See if I can find any more hoglins. Mr. Hoggy Woggy. Oh, of course. Okay, I meant an adult one that can actually drop stuff. But I mean, here, I'll drop some lava on you. There you go. You can thank me later. Okay, well, I think I've done a enough here. <laughs> Uh, I've gotten unbelievably lucky and I have obtained so much stuff from here to where uh, I'm, I'm not going to be struggling too much in the overworld. Oh God. Don't see me. Don't see me. Don't see me. Don't see me. Oh, okay. You just had to see me. Okay. Let's get the diamond pick ready. And I am hoping this works. I, oh God. I'm not really faithful on this. Oh, I have lava. I can't go up. Um, no, no. I could just power my way up with gravel. Alrighty, fingers crossed. Hopefully this works. So I now just get to stay here the entire time while I hopefully can break this obsidian. I honestly can't even tell if I'm making any progress on it, but oh, it worked. Oh my God. Yes. Oh, there's water up there. What if I do you there? Okay. It's not going to come kill me. Oh no. No, 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 no. Mine. Okay. Uh, please stop. Stop. Okay. Uh, not really what I meant to do. Won't lie. I kind of didn't want this. However, I can at least collect you and I can actually place you back into the portal if I ever wanted to go back to the nether. This is all kind of a first for me. I'm really not used to any of this. A beautiful, okay. Oh, wow, I can actually just make a portal as well. Huh. Okay, so sadly, nothing has like changed whatsoever over here, like growing wise. I kind of wish that there was a mechanic in Minecraft where it's like, oh, okay, you've been in a different dimension for 20 minutes. Let's just do like 20 minutes of growing and see what happens. You know, if that makes any sense. Anywho, let's go get organized. Then we can now make those bowls, which eh, I'm just going to save it. But you know, with these mushrooms, so I at least have like 10 more food items. Okay. Wow. But you know, I'm actually, uh, I'm actually situated for once. This is fun. Okay. Now let's go through 10 to the farm. I'm seeing a whole lot of wheat has grown, which is really nice. And then while I'm up here on the overworld, I might as well just eat bread and like carrots and potatoes and stuff. And then leave my uh, pork chops for the dangerous areas. If I go anywhere else, another thing I kind of been forgetting about this, my kelp. Oh my God. You guys have grown a lot. Okay. No, 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 stop. Ah, this farm is just killing me. There's probably a better way to actually make this. <laughs> nice. Okay. Well, I got 66 kelp from all of that. So I can't eat it. I can turn you into bone meal. What happens if I cook you though? Oh my God, I can eat it. And I eat it really fast. It doesn't do anything like whatsoever to my hunger bar or anything, but wow, you can actually eat it. So now I really have unlimited food. Can't you turn this into like a dried kelp block and then use that as fuel? Isn't that a thing? But isn't it like really bad for fuel? Wow, that is a very massive, huge tree. Uh, drop two saplings. Oh man, am I getting spoiled. And a second tree? Oh my, I'm blushing. Oh my God, look at all of those saplings. Yes, oh my gosh, yes, more. Oh, okay. Or none. Okay, so I have nine. And you can turn it into a dried kelp block. Can I turn it back? Oh, I can. Okay. Now I just need to wait for that to go through and use up all of its fuel. Okay, beautiful. Now, can you? Oh, you can. Okay, good, good. And then how many kelp will this actually cook? So 
9 kelp will cook 20 of them, so you at least make back a kelp, and then you make 11 more. So that's actually really not that bad. That's actually kind of impressive. So, let's make two more. We'll cook the rest of those, and then let's see if we can quickly go get some more kelp, just so we don't waste any of that fuel. Okay, not in that hole. Okay, beautiful, got 12 more. That should use up every single one of those. So now, wow, we really have unlimited food. Man, look at us, ah, oh, we've come such a long way. And I won't lie, I don't really know what else to do. <laughs> Okay, so since we've now kind of completely conquered the entire uh, food issue, I now need to make kind of a better home because as much as I love living like this, let's upgrade. <laughs> so first off, I suppose we can actually just use birch slabs and this is the last block. So I guess for us to get to our house, we'll make a staircase here and then because i have so many oak logs let's also use this turn you into slabs perfect and then yeah this level okay that should be perfect yep nope not like you this is so weird for me to play like this okay beautiful so this first floor okay actually oh god wait uh i don't really want to make that many chests because i really want to use a lot of crimson planks to make a uh, chest Ah, uh, let's use birch. Okay, so coming up here, since we have so much uh, space, <laughs> we can now finally start placing down chests just like this. And then let's just take all of the stone that I've gathered. My God, that is a lot. Oh God. Okay, yep, that's one thing I need to worry about. Beautiful. Then, because the nether is actually so drastically massive to me, and it's a huge part of this world, this will be our nether chest. If it'll affect any of the plants growing, but we should probably go through and we should remove the planks, place down some glowstone. So just in case if it actually matters below us, then this will help the farm with everything growing. Okay, beautiful. Oh my God, you eat it so fast. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, <laughs> I was not expecting that speed. Okay, now we can actually remove these. Then this can be our wood chest. Now the next most important one, we're gonna have food here. And then we'll have all of our uh, ores into here and then just because it really doesn't matter so here now we can have our furnace right there and then we have a crafting table right there perfect <laughs> okay perfect we're gonna leave that right here because you're almost full of bone meal and i don't want to waste that uh, let's just go and tend to our farm beautiful move you actually okay we're gonna save you i have a plan for that composter later on now uh there you know this can go multiple ways i now have a plan of what to do for kind of the rest of the movie <laughs> i think i need to remove all of this and then we're just gonna go and build a farm uh above that because i kind of need all of this water one i could you know farm up all the kelp a lot easier also um i need to go fishing for some enchanting books because um i kind of want to get villagers so now i think first off okay we have to go and remove all of these then i need to go through and remove all of these beautiful okay so uh, i won't lie it could look better out here now that i have this bucket i can go and raise up the river thingy again so it's all nice and even and not ugly beautiful and then whenever there's anything up here at the top wow look at how much easier and faster it is to collect everything also i really want this grass to grow right over here because i don't like this uh, dirt look speaking of collect now i can go around and collect all of my kelp super easily not bad almost a stack and a half okay okay all of those are planted let's make one more kelp block and then start cooking up all of this okay now, while down here is completely perfect and also uh, kind of useless with all the glow stunned, I mean, it kind of looks pretty. Now, we need to go and make our farm area. Please give me back four, please. I'm sorry, I'm stupid. Oh, thank you. I love you. Okay, so we also need dirt. And then we have water right here. And then we go boom. Okay, perfect. This should be enough space for every kind of farm that we want to do. However, I really don't like this. I was just keeping going bloop and then, you know, a bloop and then, you know, a bloop. So 
for that. One of the only fixes that I know how to do because I don't have any uh, lily pads. But even then, I don't think I'd be able to use the lily pads here. So I believe... One, fill that up with water. If I put a trapdoor right there, I mean, it's a lot nicer. That doesn't irritate me whatsoever. And now we just repeat the process a whole bunch. <laughs> and perfect. Okay, so that's all done. Sadly, no faster way for me to get down. We then take our hoe, grab all of these. And then I think we go wheat and we do wheat again. And I honestly think we just do the first three for wheat because then at this point, this should give us four bread once, you know, they're all fully grown. We do potatoes. And then the very last one, we do carrots because if I'm being honest, I don't think carrots are that good or important. Oh, but skies, if you use gold on them, you can make some golden carrots. Yeah, I know, I know. But I have way more important plans with the gold. And speaking of gold, it's about time to go right back into the nether. <laughs> oh no. Ooh, lovely. Ooh, okay, this is looking good. A lot of you look fully grown. Yeah. Oh my god, there's so much. No, 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 don't try. No, 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 no. So, man, I, I should probably raise up this floor, but at the same time, I don't know what the maximum height kelp can spawn. And you know, eh, it's not too dangerous. I, I like to live on the dangerous side. <laughs> Okay, then after replanting everything, we have 22 right here. We might as well make as many of these that we can. And then, okay, so while all of that cooks, God, we need to, we need to go have fun. So this time, let's actually be prepared. And we're going to be bringing a lot of picks because I want to try and use my diamond pick as little as possible. We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship going through a portal. Houston, I'm locked in. Your last one out, finish the mission. Okay, then let's just collect. Okay, well, I, I was gonna say, let's collect as many blocks as I can before that pick breaks. So I need to go into a new area that I haven't been into in before. Cause you know, I'll just be my highest chance of actually finding gold ore. Oh, hey, look, gold ore. I forgot to bring another crafting table. I always forget something whenever I go on my adventures. So the game plan is I need to get Oh my god, wait, I can actually get enchanting books. Oh, wait, I might not need to fish. Oh my god, I totally forgot somehow. They drop enchanting books. Why are you just sitting there? I might as well collect some mushrooms as well, even though I have so many red ones. I can always use this on the composter and just get more bone meal. There you go. Now you can't reach me because I know this is going to make you all ingy wangy. Make you a will grumpy wumpy. Oh no. Oh no, piggy wiggy all grumpy wumpy because I take his gold that's not his. Oh. Aw, I'm so, I'm so sorry, aw. I don't know if I finished my sentence from earlier, but what I'm talking about is I need to get some enchanting books. So then I can unenchant them. I can then make one lectern, get some villagers. I then make a librarian, which can then trade me books. And then I can, or bookshelves, and I make more lecterns. And then I just slowly start to get a lot more villagers and, you know, good. Yeah, beautiful. Eh, not bad. So far, we got 12. I didn't mean to bring water. Is there an easier lava source to collect for me? See, he hoo hoo. I still have not written down in my portal coordinates. I'm going to get lost. So for this entire day, I was just running around the nether. I was trying to gather as much of those lovely little gold ores that I could just so I could do a lot of trading because I have a strong suspicion that um it's going to take a lot to get some enchanting books. Okay, we're making good progress. We now have 42. And we can start trading at any point that we want. It's just I would much rather have a lot more gold. Because honestly, who wouldn't want that? <laughs> yes. Ah, oh, it's only three. I'm never going to be able to find my portal. I'm kind of losing my sense of direction. Hey, bud, do uh, you want to give me a uh, enchanting book like right now? Possibly like two. Or blackstone. That also works. Oh, okay. <gasps> oh, okay. I was about to light you on fire, but wa wait a second. You might be good. Never mind. Okay, yep, you're not good anymore. I also had to kill him or else he was going to fight me right here. Oh, okay. Can I get, okay, can I get this one at least? Okay, can I get this one at least? Okay, cool. Hi, friend. Give me something good or else your child gets hit. <laughs> that wasn't me. I, I did not do that to your child. Yeah, seeing how I haven't gotten any enchanting books yet 
even though I barely traded, but I have a sneaking suspicion it's going to take a lot of gold. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Oh my god. I can make a bed. It only took 33 days, but I can finally make a bed. Please stop trying to run. I just have a few more trades. I really did not get like anything good. <laughs> At least it seems like all of the gold ore spawns are starting to really pick up down here. So I might have found a really good area for them. Oh my god. Hi, hi, hi. Hi, hi, hi. Oh my god. Wow. He did not make any noise whatsoever. Oh my god. Now I'm no herbalist, but this seems like a very weird spot for mushrooms to grow. No, 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 no. I won't lie. This is definitely the most interesting route that I've gone to have to play. But this is actually really fun and enjoyable for me. Okay, that lava moved a little bit too fast. That was a little sussy. It might be time for me to find some hoglins soon. Might be time. I'm getting a little uh, low on food. Oh, wow. I have 60, so I think we have enough to go and play some trading again. Ooh, but don't mind if I do. Okay, just like that, we're organized, and let's see if we can go find some piglins. Hi! I won't lie, I kind of want to go find more than just one of you because I really don't feel like doing 60 trades with one hoglin. I'm piglin. But thank you for all obsidian trades. Hi. Oh my god, almost hit you. Hopefully I can get a lot of iron nuggets in the next trade. Or if I get more black stone, that can also help. No, okay, that's not fair. That's really unfair. <laughs> oh, come on. You can barely see me. I don't want to play. I just want to get my gold nuggies. You can get this arrow. Oh, I now have about 86 trades so uh, ooh, i just I, I can't help it every single time i say gold i just want to collect it oh where are the piglins i oh god dude how am i gonna find my portal man okay yep have fun with that blast you know like i might be able to find my portal but honestly i just don't know where it is i have no idea which route i took sos save our skies i'm pretty sure i'm i should be going uh, oh wait there's an what is this the same crimson forest that's near my portal surely not this might look familiar for me uh, this is not looking good i'm oh god i am so lost oh hey some people i can trade with hi hi everyone do i have gold for you okay not here just come here not looking good so far why are you walking over there? No, no, no. Come here. Hi. Okay, so that's almost broken. Don't care for you. So while I have a quick chance to breathe right now, I collected some wood from a tree. I then got black stone from those piglins. So now I finally don't have to use my diamond pick anymore. Make another stone axe. And honestly, we should just make another stone pickaxe just to be safe. Alrighty, boys. Now here, let's just do the typical trading hole thank you there you go you guys aren't gonna go anywhere on me now then i can make myself a nice little trash can for me oh god what was that don't 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 go away don't go away you know just burnt a baby to death feeling great oh oh my god yes oh my god we got one okay i believe i collected that first enchanting book that i got from them so i think that's my second one not my first oh god please don't come over here oh nice brand new boots now i should probably mention how there's probably going to be some of you that are unhappy that I'm in the nether given that this is a straight line only challenge. I kind of completed all of the challenges on the overworld in like 15 or 20 days. So for me to actually continue playing and to have content, I have to do this. So I'm really sorry that this is kind of going against the challenge, but I really have nothing else to do unless you only want the movie to be like 20 days long. Oh my God, there's so many hoglins starting to get near. Oh my God, please be faster. So very unluckily, I have 20 ingots left. Oh, I did get a lot of iron nuggets. That's really nice. Got four ingots from them so far. So that's good. Oh, and we just got even, oh my God, we got so many iron nuggets now. Nice, 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 nice. It's not nice is how I'm not getting any more enchanting books. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, just one, just one, just one, please. Ah, 
So out of like 90 something trades, I got one book and we just need possibly one more. Since you guys were kind to me and you actually gave me one book, I actually won't kill you, but um, I'm not going to release you. Just, you know, I, I don't know. I just don't really want to. Uh, oh my God, you can actually get over here. You can get over here. Yep. Oh my God, of course that's a baby. Oh, but I don't want to hit the adults again because you might die any second. Please die, please die. Yes, 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 more food. Can you die, please? Go away, you don't give me anything, thank you. I don't know why you're so aggressive to me, like I just killed your parent right in front of you. Oh, that was your wife? I'm sorry. Not really, I'm just saying that to see if that'll make you like treat me any kinder. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Thank you. With there being an entire horde of piglins here, you guys most likely went around and started killing a lot of those hog ones. The downside? The downside is how, okay, well, I just lit every single one of you on fire, which I actually didn't mean to do, but you know, I'll just finish it now because it's kind of awkward if I leave any of you alive. But you guys don't cook any of the pork from them. Out of all of those hoglin kills, it only dropped leather. There you go. Yeah. Hey, that that's why you shouldn't charge me. I'm just saying. Like, you don't drop me anything, so I'm not going to go for you. Don't kill it. Don't kill it. Don't kill it. Don't kill it. Thank you. Oh, dang it. Just die, please. Thank you. Ooh, look at all that food. Oh my gosh, that was seven. Okay, I'm really sorry, bro. I'm nothing against you whatsoever, but I have to do that so you don't kill any hoglins. I really, really do not want to cook any of the pork and then i know it's a complete waste for me to like only be going for the hoglins right now it's just i really really want to get more food so we'll spend a little, little bit more time on them i hear some over here hi thank you don't burn don't burn yes oh my god that was so close oh <laughs> Oh man, that cut it so close. Hi. Oh god, oh god, no, 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 go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Yes. By the way, I'm completely lost again. No idea where I ran. Did you burn? Man, he ran back into the lava. <laughs> Dang it. Arr, I keep burning the pork chops. I just like to put down the lava you know kind of a lot because it also slows them down so they're not gonna hit me please don't dang it ah that sucks Ooh, but this doesn't suck i finally got some more gold at the very least i can get bored enough of doing this to where we just go fishing for the last one but that could legit take me hours which would equate to dozens of days so i don't know if it would be smart to spend like 60% of this movie just fishing. <laughs> Can lava clear out fire? It does. I don't know. Am I the only one that's kind of curious why they don't get mad if you eat pork in front of them? Like I just thought about it, but it just seems like a little bit weird to me. Okay, I have 33 gold ingots and there's... Ooh, nice, nice. Yes, you two, you two. Don't move, don't move. Okay, good, good. Don't move just yet, please. Not yet, not yet, not yet. Okay, good. Now, just load them up with gold put our lava there and now we just trade and wait that was it oh my god you guys barely gave me anything oh god Ugh, the last 12 please please just a book please oh my god that was it i basically just got a lot of arrows and iron nuggets oh my god nothing uh yeah you guys deserve this and you know what here you're just gonna be collateral uh you know what, here, I'm gonna make you guys collateral as well. I thought, why are you guys being friends? Oh my god, there's another one, there's another one, there's another one, there's another one. Oh my god, I just walked right into it. Oh dear god, this biome never ends. Oh my god, wait. Oh, I'm back here. No way, what's up, bros? Hi. No, 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 no. No, I have arrows. I don't know why I don't just do hi. Oh, uh, I only have 10, so you guys can't disappoint me too much. At the very least, they gave me iron, and it's kind of really nice, because now I'm starting to get a lot of iron. Sorry. Sorry, I just, uh, I just really don't want you to attack, man. Sorry, buddy. Yep, yep, has to be done. Oh my god. Sorry, you gotta go. I don't make the rules. It's just uh, I need this gold right here. Hi, hi. Didn't see you, didn't see you. Stop it. No, thank you. It also doesn't make sense to me on why these piglins are so angry at me mining all of this gold. It's only been here for a couple of thousand years on touch. Oh, that makes sense now. Hi. Come here a little bit, see. Come on, stop 
Stop tricking me around the tree. Come here. Okay, that's awkward. There you go. Yes, perfect. Don't die just yet. Okay, good. Okay, now you can die. Hi, bud. Here, come right here. Thank you. Oh my god, you are so tanky. Mm -mm, nope, that sucks. Oh, is it hot in there? Oh, man, I wonder why. Wait, 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 wait. No, I need to charge up my crossbow. No, 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 no. I need you to die before you're not on fire. Thank you. Oh my god, there's so many of you. Here we go. Beautiful. Yes, got a twofer. Okay, thank you. I just wanted to collect my gold. Oh, cool. Well, it was just one. Okay, well, uh, I have 20. We can we can take our chances with this guy. What? Hello? Excuse you? What? Do you not like my gold? That was entirely your fault. You literally ran into that. Please. Or paper. I'll even take that. Just something to make a book. At this point, I'm getting so many arrows that I could actually take on the Ender Dragon. Ugh. I hate you. So now it's really nice being in the Crimson Forest. Don't get me wrong. Where are you going? What? Come here. Come here. Let me light you on fire. Thank you. As I was saying, however, I should probably leave this place because I'm not really finding any gold here. And I think I'll have way higher chances than other biomes. The only issue is that I'm actually trying to find my way out of the Crimson Forest. But the more I run, the more Crimson Forest that I find. There is no way I just did an entire circle. Hi. Oh my God, you're so tanky. Did I really just run in a circle again? Oh my God, I ran in another circle. Okay, we're picking this direction and we're going. I'm not going left or right at all. Okay, okay. I was not expecting them to be able to reach me. I need my lava. Operation Retrieve Lava. Sheesh, 69 pork chops. Stop laughing. <gasps> Finally, oh my god, we're out. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Oh my gosh, oh, I never want to return here. Finally, something other than painful red. It's just regular red. Also, I'm kind of curious if you guys can leave a comment on this. Which series do you prefer more? 50 hours or 100 days? Because with 100 days, you're actually seeing everything that I do and I can't cut it out. Whereas 50 hours, I'd be able to cut down a lot of this nether exploring out. Now, since I've done so much trading, I can just make myself an iron pick. Whoo, look at that speed, oh my goodness. Nice. Not really a good sign for gold, but at least I'm in a familiar place. Hi. Oh God, yep, you don't like it when I take my gold. <laughs> oh man, I'm really getting burnt out of the nether. Oh, wow. We actually had like an even 30. Okay. Well, hopefully with me gathering that much gold, I can actually get a book. And also another reason for bridging, well, not bridging, but towering all the way up here is that I, I have a good feeling that my portal is kind of in this direction. Like, I don't know where my portal is, but I do have a general direction that I think it is. Oh dear God, please no. Now, given I really don't want to go to either of these Crimson Forests, that's also kind of a good sign because my portal was somewhat near one of them. Is this my crimson forest? Oh my god, this is my spot. All of this is looking way too familiar. There's no way it's not. Oh, I now have 60 gold ingots. High hopes that my portal is nearby. Oh my god, okay, I didn't want to do that. I made a complete circle. That's cool. Don't die. Yes, okay, good. Yeah, hey, just stay right there. Yeah, right there. Perfect. Thank you. Oh, stay, bud. I got that. I got the good stuff. If you wanna, you wanna trade me with it? No, 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 no. Get, get in the hole, though. Okay, thank you. Here you go. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Please, please stay in here. Thank you. Here you go. This is the good stuff that you want. Do not come over here. Do not come over here. Here, can I entice some of you to come with me into my hole? But like, not like that. You got it, buddy. Oh, you don't got it, buddy. Into here, into here. There you go. Yes, yes. No, get into the hole. There you go. Yes, yes. Into my hole, into, get in my hole. Yes. Oh dear God, there's so much iron. I'm cutting it so close. It's really, really not looking good. Hey, buds, you, you want to come over here and get in my hole? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does that sound enticing to you, huh? Okay, but get into my hole. In, in, oh my God, I almost walked into my lava. Okay, there you go. Yes, yes, yes. Into the hole. Perfect. Okay, now we got four. Actually, here you go. All of you deserve lava. Woo! 
because I'm still not getting any enchanting books. That was not me. I swear. I don't know where that came from. Uh, but hey, you want to trade? Come on, give me that insane luck. Come on, the last one you want to give me an enchanting book. Come on. Okay, come on. This one right here, it's an enchanting book. I just know it. Come on, you want to give me it? Come on. I hate you so much. You deserve this. I can almost not even trade anymore. I'm kidding. My inventory is so full. Um, but here, I, I can give you some lava, though. I, I always got time for that. God! Okay, I guess I deserve that. It's kind of karma. Yep, come one, come all. It's fun for the whole family. I'm only gonna shoot you because I have so many arrows that I kind of need to get rid of them. Uh, this is looking familiar. I think I remember that. I just remember it was somewhere high up with a burning piglin right there and another one specifically right there. Oh, portal. Where are you? Soldier boy told me it was right here. Oh my god, yes. Oh, my portal. Put the diamond pick first. Oh my god, I can finally go home. Oh my god, yes. Oh, man, we were in there for an intensely long time. Oh, it's so beautiful to be back. And honest, no, no, never mind. I have wood right there. Never mind. Holy, dude, I can finally go and get uh, organized. So that's really good. And at the end of all of that, I got 16 iron ingots. That is insane. And then I've noticed that I have received so much string. So I can make 19 wool. I'm not even worried about like, oh no, but now I can't turn it back into string. What if I wanted to make a fishing rod? Doesn't matter. I'll be trading more. And I'm very positive I'll receive more string instead of an enchanting book. Speaking of which, oh yes, I do have one right there. Okay, good. So now we just need one more and then I can finally make my lectern. And then don't mind me, just gonna go get organized. Okay, so this might not be smart, but at the same time, this might be smart. Okay, so I have a lot of extra mushrooms after collecting so many of those. I already have 64 both colors on my chest, so now I can use all of this on bone meal instead. And now since we have so much iron, I think we should invest in more armor, which I regret making a helmet instead of Pants, but oh well, I'm not going to waste it. So I just awkwardly have gold pants instead of a gold helmet because I'm really stupid. <sighs> Even though I've barely been in the overworld, I almost think we might as well just go straight back into the nether just so I can get that one book. Oh, I need to get obsidian. That's actually not a bad idea just to leave some water right here just so I can just immediately just go up into my base after coming out of the nether. So now I'm ready to go back in. I forgot to bring another pick once again and uh, yep, still don't have my crafting table. I always leave that behind. <laughs> not like it matters. Now the hard part is going to be choosing where do I want to go? <laughs> I'm starting to run out of immediate areas around my portal where I can get more gold ore. We check out this direction and it's totally not because I can run fast and it's super fun. Dang it, I almost did it without it even hitting me. Oh yeah, no, no, come right, right here. There you go, beautiful, yes. Oh, you wanna come party too? Okay, here you go, buddy. There you go. Anything down here at all? Okay, maybe we don't go this direction. Oh, hello. Oh my God, there's so many of you. Why are there so many hoglids? <laughs> ah, I really want one of them to drop their crossbow so I can repair mine. Well, I know this is going to make me get lost again, but honestly, I guess we just travel down and go out. I see you, gold. Oh, you hoo Piggy wiggy. Wrong kind of pig. Nope, nope, wrong kind. Are you good? Are you Aren't I dancing on me? Are you okay? Yeah, can you give me some blackstone? No, 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 blackstone. Okay, close, but nope. <laughs> Imagine if you just gave me like an enchanting book right now. <laughs> God, that'd be so like, so random. Okay, now we can go back here, continue going down, and I am going to try my absolute best to not get lost and remember the direction back. I'm sure that's gonna happen. Okay, and we're off to a good start. This is looking nice. Tee hee hoo hoo, I know your plan. Okay, so if I do this i should be able to get all of these beautiful okay at this rate we actually probably won't be in the nether for that long day 46 and i'm still looking for gold so we're at 37 ingots so far and just lit a child on fire so that's going well there i wait what i just made an entire circle <laughs> okay so maybe going this direction will just be a lot better because now i'm just gonna assume that i'm 
I've, you know, never been this one. Another interesting observation that uh, I've been noticing, where are the nether fortresses? <laughs> I really feel like they shouldn't be this rare. Oh, yay, my nether crimson forest. Oh, gold. Okay, so since my pick is almost broken, I think it would be smart if I immediately just start trading, which I have 51 gold ingots. So you and I are about to become very good friends. Why are you running from me? Why are you acting like my IRL friend? No, stop. No, 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 no. Stop, stop running, please. I just want to hang out. Not with you. We'll get them together. Yeah. Yeah, you keep shooting and I keep lighting him on fire. Yeah, don't go into the fire. You're so dumb. What's up, bud? You look like a man who wants to get some gold. Okay, good, good. Don't move, don't move, don't move. I'm trapping. Yes. I have a permanent friend. Okay, get to trading, boy. Mm, but I don't want that. No, oh, I don't need more leather or that. Oh, yes, I actually need you. No, I want to snipe you, but I'm so scared that if I shoot right here, I might hit a zombified piglin and I really don't need all of them chasing me. Pretty soon, I might as well just take my chances with fishing. Oh my god, I'm gonna go insane, please. Please, I'm so tired of being in the nether, please. Okay, here's my last 10. Can you please be kind to me? Please, that's the last one, please. Please, you want to give me an enchanting book, please. Oh, <laughs> Okay, for my sanity, uh, I think I'm going to try this one last time. We're just going to go around and get a little bit more gold. We're going to do one last trading session. And if it, I, if I can't get an enchanting book, then I'm just going to go fishing. Because at this point, I think I will have higher chances doing that. Because it should take like roughly an hour or two of fishing, which is like six or seven days, which is drastically less time than what I've been spending in the nether. I'm going in shame oh my god oh my god oh my god okay. holy dude i thought it was lava down here not magma blocks okay oh man that woke me up you know what I, I think i'm down to feel something so they can give me gold honestly if i just sit right here let them all run to me how much wood do i have okay so i can still make like two swords if need be but i'm just i think this might be a little bit faster than mining now the sad thing is that i can't put down lava to kill them or else i would have made this farming tremendously faster oh my god my plan does work oh my god i i was waiting until way later in the movie to explain what i was going to do to get villagers but oh my god it works oh my gosh it works yes so my plan for getting villagers was to actually just come in here do this exact thing near my portal and then just keep on farming until i get zombified villagers but actually before even doing that i was going to go back into the overworld make my nether portal way larger and figure out a way to break the portal so that then it's so much easier just to show you guys, but trust me, it's going to be really fancy and nice. Now, the hard part is going to be to actually kill all of you before more of you arrive, because this is really not going that fast. The downside is going to be uh, once these two run out. <laughs> I then spent a couple minutes just farming all of the zombified piglin right here, and whoo, man, after all of that farming, I got about 14 golden nuggets. Don't think this way is a lot more efficient. <laughs> okay, so that was super duper fun very efficient um at least i got a pretty nice gold sword out of that Ooh. <laughs> no don't don't just don't notice me don't notice me there we go what's up budheads however at least i tested that out instead of getting thousands of comments of people telling me that i could have just farmed zombified piglin for faster gold because that was most definitely not faster and arguably more expensive to do it that way I'm starting to wonder if it would have been faster for me to build like a makeshift gold farm like a really really bad designed one that was just like put together really fast i wonder if that would have made this entire adventure faster oh god i am totally gonna get lost in here i am never finding my way back to my portal Ooh, but that's okay because there's gold right here oh my god I do, how do i keep running in circles how have i been here already okay i have 48 gold ingots i think this is going to be my last time doing this kind of trading if i don't get it we're going fishing because i am getting so sick and tired of you guys yeah i'm talking about you your life is on the line stop giving me garbage hey buddy want to come trade oh dear god not you not you oh my god i didn't mean to do that i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry why are you not trading i was clicking on you with a gold bar take it 
Take it. Take it. Oh, so now you do it. Okay, here. Don't care for any of these. Oh, dear God, they're getting closer. Can I hit it? Uh, alley -oop. I have no idea how to fire crossbows. They shoot so differently from bows. Oh my God, you're really close to me. There we go. Whew, okay, don't worry, buddy, we're safe. I can't really speak about you being safe for too much longer if you don't give me what I want. And well, I had 20 trades to go off of for this guy. And, um, well, my... Something eventful happened, a gas spawned nearby, so at least I was able to shoot something, and yep, after all of that trading, I still got nothing. So, at this point, I'm just, I'm so tired of the nether, I just, I can't do it anymore in here. <sighs> okay, so we need to find the portal again, which I won't lie, I don't exactly know where it is. I kind of roughly remember the coordinates of it, so I'm kind of safe. But okay, nether, it's been fun, I, god, I really don't want to come back here. <sighs> However, sadly, I will have to come back in here if I want my villagers. Oi, I've been here before. Okay, good sign. That's why I always do that with lava. I always box them in just so it's some kind of a landmark so I know where I relatively am. Okay, I think my portal should be right there. Ow. What if I just go like, boop, and then I take you. Okay, yep, see you later, buddy. Wait, wait, wait. It's very important. Okay. Like, whew, okay, now see you later. Let me free, please. Oh my god, thank you. <sighs> uh, oh god, uh. Oh wait, never mind. I can just pill her out. And as soon as that sun came up, I immediately got to organizing because my entire inventory was a mess. Okay, so very luckily with all of that string, uh, let's see. Boom! Ah, oh, man, I'm, whew, man, am I, oh, am I excited to use you? Oh, boy. Boy, we are gonna have so much fun. With my luck, I can actually fish from here, right? If not, then there goes my idea. Please don't make me go back into the nether. <gasps> yes, it works. Oh my God, yes. Okay, I won't lie. It's actually really difficult to notice when there's a fish going for it, but I can at least fish. And then I guess at least this way, I'm not gonna get bored because I actually have to focus and pay attention to the buoy or the bobber. I don't know what to call it. And after fishing all day, I got three Call of Duties and yeah, basically uh, nothing else. I, I got a modded fish because I kind of forgot to turn off the mod. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess that also decreases my chances of getting a enchanting book. So it's going to be interesting to see uh, how long I keep this up for. Now, this will surprise you. Today, I just fished. Given how I didn't turn off any of the mods from my 100 days on a raft movie, which if you haven't seen that, totally you should go watch it. It's a really good movie. I got a diamond crate. And since I never figured out how to open it in that movie, in this one, I looked it up online. And yeah, apparently you just have to look up away from any block, you then crouch and then you right click and boom, I was able to open the crate. Inside of it, I got some iron, some diamonds, and then some like nuggets. And I got like six bottles of enchanting. So it was a pretty good find. Other than that, for the rest of the day, I just kept on capturing a lot of cod and other fish. It was really useless. Oh, and then day 53 came by. So um, there's one interesting thing with one of the mods that I have the go fish mod. You see, today was rainy and normally that wouldn't be an issue for fishing whatsoever in Minecraft, um, except for the fact that I was only getting rainy bass today, like nothing else. I was just getting this blue fish, which was cool, you know, I guess, but I really don't need it. I also tried out my other shader, the Kappa shader, which I, eh, I don't know if I'm a fan of this one. I, I just wanted to see if I can make the water look pretty so it wasn't just so dark. But I don't think I'm a fan of what it's doing to all of the kelp, so it kind of looks weird, so my bad. Now, you see, today I figured that the enchanting book was just trying to throw me a curveball. So instead, I went to the other side to go fishing, which didn't really have any kind of effect whatsoever. I did manage to get an iron crate, which inside was like nine wheat and three seaweed, and I think some coal, so it was an interesting crate, uh, really useless to me, but it was kind of cool to see it. And then for the rest of the day, it was just more fish. And then right at the beginning of day 55, when I thought, man, I'm going to be here for so long, I got an iron crate, I opened it, and inside, I managed to get an enchanting book. Oh my gosh, yes! Holy, I just got 
the piercing to enchanting book. I got like potatoes, oak planks, blah, blah, blah. Everything else doesn't matter. Oh my God, I, I have the third enchanting book that I need for enchanting books anymore. Oh my gosh. Okay, so first up, let's just go and get organized. I uh, kind of have a lot. Let's go through and we need to cook up some cobblestone. Just need this. Go into you. Ah, bop. Boom, boom. Okay, so you can go there. Take these three. Go to you. Boom, boom. How? And then with that, I think it was like this. Or did I? Do I have it backwards? There we go. Oh my god, I have a lectern. Okay. Holy dude, this is so good. And then we'll just put you right there. This time, I won't forget anything. And I have a feeling we're going to be killing a lot of zombified piglins. So I'm just going to make sure that I am very prepared for them. Probably going to need these. Now, first off, before we actually head into the nether, I need to rebuild my portal portal very differently. Now, my biggest worry is that I need zombies to go through the portal. If they go through the portal when it's only like a two by three block uh, portal, they're gonna kill me. There's gonna be no way that I can actually break out of the portal before they try to kill me. So instead, Dead. If I give myself a lot of room and some jumping room on top, you go up to here, bring this right across. Let's first try breaking the portal before I do anything else. So here's our lovely new portal. So much room, blah, blah, blah. Okay, now if I light you, can I break you with lava? Oh, um, can I break the portal by punching it? Okay, what about with the diamond pit? Okay, what about with water? So, oh my god, how did I do that? Oh my god, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I can break it. Oh, that's huge. Wait, wait, how did I do that? Oh, okay, so I just go over to like the barrier block and then I can put down some water. Okay, that is huge. Yes, okay. Oh, I thought I was, I was doomed. I, I thought I wasn't going to be able to do this at all. Okay, so that is amazing news. I'm incredibly happy with that. Okay, then here's my next idea is that the zombies are going to be rushing me nonstop. What I'm going to have to do is just start punching them away from me. Once I have enough space, I quickly just do this and then they should still be able to jump up. Okay, so I have to do three of these, but this will at least create a wall between us. And I'm just choosing this instead of a regular block. Why am I using that instead of a regular block? Actually, never mind. I can't even give a reason. <laughs> yeah, never mind. I actually don't know why I'm using trap doors. Okay, so I'll just bring netherrack instead, but I'm just gonna keep the trap doors just to be safe. Like, I don't know, just in case if I need them. Now, where do I want to farm you guys? And I think relatively right here should be good enough. We just need a lot more of you guys. Are you holding a crossbow? Are you the piglin that went through my portal and then got teleported back? <laughs> nice. I ow, hope you can't use that. Okay, good, good. Okay, more spawning in. So, boop, and then I run over here. Get all of these guys triggered in as well. Okay. Now, ah, okay, less babies though. So now what the goal here is to just beat them up, you know, keep killing them, blah, blah, blah. And you see, I'm not actually trying to kill them. Like I really couldn't care less about them, even though I kind of need them to die before I need to go to the portal or else, and you know, I'm going to have some issues, but there's a chance in the nether that zombies will spawn in as like for backup for them. And then out of those zombies, there's a 5% chance chance that the zombie can be a zombified villager. So basically what that means for me is that I'm going to have to do this for a very long time. Wow, they also dropped two ingots. So uh, man, I wish you guys did that, you know, several decades ago for me. <laughs> so I don't want to go too far away from the portal or else then I just have to walk a zombie even farther. So hopefully and find some more like pretty close by. That'd be really nice. Oh, zombified pig lens. How many of you would like to come over here? Oh God, I said zombified piglins is not a flying turd. Hello there, Mr. Oink Oink. Do you have more friends? Don't touch me. Okay, well, if it's just YouTube, I don't even need <laughs> make a pillar. Wow, you guys really hurt. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'm a, a helpless little 
penguin. I sure hope no zombified piglins come over here and, um... Oh, come on! That is a lot fair! That was fair, though. If you guys can, I need, like, roughly maybe, like, a hundred of you or something, or... Um, oh, wait, actually, even better. Instead of you guys, if you want, you can actually just call in some... You know, zombified villagers to help you out. They're really good backup. Boing, boing, boing. Boing, boing, boing. Okay, I see you guys are calling in more. However, uh, not the correct mob that I need. Boing, ow. Now, another thing that I'm starting to wonder, would zombies spawn in more depending on the biome? Also, I don't have lava. Oh my God, there's so many of you. Okay, good, good. You stepped in fire, really smart. I mean, oh, I can still light you guys on fire. Oh my God. Okay, this is starting to get awkward. Come here, Mr. Piggies. I need you to go on fire fire beautiful no no don't mind me yeah no you, you don't need to help whatsoever i have this all under control they keep coming don't touch me i mean i guess it's a good thing that i can shoot but i just don't want to tower up because i have a strong feeling that a hoggling can you know hit me Alrighty, boys <sighs> gets work. This hurts me more than it hurts you. Are you good? What did you just run in there and steal? You little brat. He keeps going back in and stealing. I thought you were supposed to be scared of zombified piglin. Oh my god, look at all you stole. Oh my god, I need to go get that stuff before a different piglin comes by and yoinks it. I do not think that I brought enough swords. Don't worry, this doesn't hurt me whatsoever. This brings me joy. Alrighty, boys, are you guys ready for round two? Because I sure am. Yep, yep, yep. Please don't be scared to call in your green friends if you can. Oh, you little... Okay, awesome. I love it how you just spawn in randomly and just instantly get to shooting. Okay, maybe it's location. It has to be location. Okay, let's see. Maybe around here we should be fine. Is it just me or like, is the nether never supposed to be this empty? <laughs> I swear I usually always have an issue with there being too many things in the nether. Hey, buddy, yeah. Can you spawn in some green boys? A chew. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, dude, allergies, man. Jeez. Alrighty, boys. You ready? It's almost like you guys are angry or something. Jeez. I wonder if I just need to kill them slower. Like, maybe I'm working too fast. Gotta beat them up a little bit. You know, make them think like, oh, no, we're in danger. Ah, we need backup. Ah, and then, yeah. And the zombies will spawn in, right? Wait, maybe I just don't kill. Maybe like every now and then I'll, I'll kill one, but maybe for the most part, I actually just camp. So I tried out my idea of just sitting here on my pillar and not killing them, except occasionally here and there, I would by accident. And my idea kind of works. I'm noticing that zombified piglin are actually spawning in and they're coming towards me, but I can't tell if they're reinforcements or if they're just natural spawns. So it could be the location that I'm at is probably not optimal for actually getting reinforcements. And then towards the end, I was just getting really bored. So I got out a cooked pork chop and then I started to smack all of them very rapidly. It was probably enraging them because I believe I was smacking them with their uncle. Yeah, it seems like you guys are definitely calling in reinforcements. So it might be working. However, even though it's working, I kind of want to move spots because I don't think I'm in a very good one. One thing that I just uh, kind of realized, if I do get a zombie, I kind of don't have a really good portal location to, you know, send them through. I can get stuck very easily, so we might want to go through and clear this up a little bit. Now, alrighty, boys. Wait, where did I? No, 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 no. I saw like a huge swarm of them somewhere. There might be a better spot. Nom, 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 nom. Okay, yeah. Can you call on your brothers? Thank you. And now it's just a waiting game. Yep. Yep, I need you all to come here. Get, get a little angy wangy. Why is there always a baby? Please drop your bow. No, not a helmet. Okay, okay. The reinforcements are working. Okay, so maybe I need to lower down my little uh, zombified piglin pool right here. Nice, nice. Okay, the idea is kind of working. You guys don't need to constantly drop and pick up stuff. It's totally okay. Just look at them. Interesting enough, I didn't catch it on camera, but a piglin actually spawned in with three zombified piglin. I didn't even know that was like a combo. 
Okay, so the downside, we might have to return home. Let's go, boys. Why are why did you guys spawn in? Probably the worst time for me to do this. I just really want to see if I can get you guys to drop your crossbows, which looks like no. What's up, boys? Why can I not get zombies to spawn in anymore? Hey, can I borrow a sword from any of you at all? Or I guess you can just call me Sight tomorrow. I can kill some of you in uh, one punch if I get you down to half a heart. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, finally use my axe not you i am definitely not good with you okay so i'm still not done in here but we might just want to return home and start making some new tools why are you all mad at me now why why is it raining men hallelujah <laughs> oh my god there's so many of you wow okay yep you guys were definitely spawning in reinforcements uh, i see where every single one of them has gone jeez okay never mind we are not returning home uh so i was correct to make it right here. That way I don't have any of you raining down on me. Wow, there's so many of you. Okay, let's get to work. Okay, so out of these dozens of spawns, not one zombie. Okay, okay. So you guys can spawn them in. That's lovely. Okay, can you guys stop spawning in though? But... <laughs> God, uh, but none of them are zombified villagers. Update, this is not looking good. I can't kill them fast enough before they spawn in again. Now I can shoot you guys, but I'd much rather not do that. Uh, I guess a shovel. Jesus, okay. Well, I mean, it barely does any damage, but I suppose it's better than nothing. Uh, to be fair, I wasn't expecting 40 of you to drop from my head. Oh my God, more of you spawned in. Just saying, I should totally be able to use lava on them to kill them okay you know what okay here. all of you come on to this side thank you okay there we go that actually worked out pretty well at the very least zombies did spawn in so i, I guess we're on the right track i just really didn't know uh how rare they are so you now it's just so much fun for me just to come through the portal and do that oh it's so much oh my jesus christ hi oh let's make ourselves some iron tools you know let's go splurge especially since i know how to get unlimited iron now and honestly since we have six diamonds uh hello diamond sword and then just to be safe just because seeing how much fighting i was doing yeah let's make ourselves an iron one that'll probably come in a uh, huge handy and then that was a beautiful little pit stop and let's just go right back in oh you so okay i need to run I, I regret that, I regret that, I regret that, I regret that. Oh, I did that way too. I don't have any blocks. Oh my God, uh, I was doing it for a bit. Whoop, nope, mine, okay. Alrighty boys, so you might be wondering what I've gathered you all here for today. Now, there's some green people I'm looking for and they don't have layers like onions, which that joke probably made like no sense to anyone unless you've seen Shrek. Oh, 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 oh. Do I even need to kill them at all? I'm gonna have to if I ever want to move around the nether again. But I'm kind of curious if I don't touch them whatsoever. Are all the other mobs that spawn around the nether like that? Are they just gonna disappear and then like respawn down here as reinforcements? How many are above me? <laughs> this might kill me, but I'm ready to run fast. If I go down to two blocks instead and then I hit you. So this will probably save me a lot of durability on my sword. Oh my god. No. That's exactly what I was worried about, though. That is why I don't like to do two blocks. Oh, look, they are above me. Okay. Nope, so it saves a lot on my durability, but it doesn't save a lot on my health. Yeah, that's for touching me. No, no touching. No touching the merchandise. I also think I need to kill you guys. So I need you to follow me, bud. Okay. Okay, but wait, wait, wait. Let me, let me get the rest of the loot. Just wait, 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 wait. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Let me, let me just shave off the top. Okay. okay. So here, let, let's go for a stroll. Sami, how's the family been doing? How are the kids, the wife? You know, how's it all going? Hello, can you please drop that? Uh, can you drop yours? <gasps> yes, yes, you dropped it. Yes, yeah. Oh my God. Wow, 29 more. Thank you. Now, there's one thing that I just realized and now I'm kind of worried about it is that even if I were to get a zombified villager and I bring it back to my base, I can't place down a boat to make them uh, not despawn. And I don't have a name tag. So there 
might be a slight issue to where I might have to stay here until I have two zombified villagers. Oh, there's so many hurdles to jump through. And today was just like the rest of them. I just stayed on my little pillar, kept running around, aggroing more zombified piglin, and I never got one zombie. So the one thing that I'm noticing about this area is that it's not the best to do this. So I think it's time for me to move because there's a layer maybe 20 blocks above me. And the problem is that the zombified piglin love to spawn up there. And that is really, really slowing this down. So I think it's time that we make a move straight on out of here. And I traveled so far, maybe like 50 blocks, like 100 blocks, like right in front of me. So I'm practically still in the exact same spot. But I thought, okay, this spot should be really good because, you know, it's kind of nice and open. There's nothing really above me. So they can't really get stuck anywhere. And boy, Boy, was I wrong. <laughs> um, it was a good idea at first, but they just kind of stopped coming. I don't know uh, what happened to them. I don't know where they were spawning. But by the end of today, I think I figured out the greatest spot to actually farm them. So I just moved on from this spot as well, right over to this area, which once again is about like a hundred blocks from my last area. This time though, kind of near the beginning when I was farming all of them and I was just looking around, I noticed a zombie. Sadly, it was just one zombie and it was a regular zombie, so it was really useless to me, but we finally saw another one, so at least I might be making some kind of progress. However, this entire time that I was farming them, I kind of remembered I don't have any apples, and it kind of takes a long time for trees to grow. However, there is one way to make them grow faster. Oh god, no, not you. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's by skeletons, don't hurt me. So, if I, oh my god, you're actually going to follow me all the way out here. Go away go oh my gosh oh my god i hate you now as i was saying but i can stay over here in this biome and actually just farm skeletons oh my god you're still here go away what wait really don't kill yourself. No. Don't damage yourself. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, can you hold this? Please, please, please. I need you to pick up something. Oh my god. <laughs> so okay. Um, thank you for finally coming by. Uh, it would really help me if you would pick up an item, though. I, I really need you to not despawn. Come on, buddy. I need you to pick up something. Anything in your hand. Please, here, can you pick up a block? I'm not dropping you my diamond sword. Guess what we can try and do. Okay, I need to get something for him to actually carry. My assumption is going to be rotten flesh. Okay, maybe you can only pick up stuff that was like not dropped from me. So maybe you can pick up these. Here, do you want an iron shovel? Is that what you want? Oh, <gasps> wait, what if I make a minecart? If I bring them back to the overworld, I can make a rail and a minecart. I think I have enough iron for that. And then those can be placed down on a one block wide world. That might work. The issue is, is it nighttime or is it daytime? Okay, let's just make our way towards the portal. Let's see if you can even make it that far. Hey, boys. We're friendly, right? Oh, Gasty Poo, where are you? Please don't walk into any fire. Wait, I can always make a boat in here and then I can just keep them at the portal until I'm ready. Oh my god. Oh, let's try that instead. Wait, wait, wait. That might be way smarter and safer. You're killing me with how slow you walk, though. Yes. No, no, no. I can't make a boat with this? Really? Oh my god, I can't make a boat with that. Are you kidding? I swore in my life there was always a crimson boat. Oh my god, why does this have to be so excruciating? We probably would have been at the portal by now. Come on, Bominos. Dum, dum. Everybody, let's go Boom, boom. Oh, man, when I tell you I am nervous, that is an understatement. Okay. Come over here, walk through the portal. As soon as I get through there, I just need to place down the water bucket, smack him away from me, place down two blocks. And if I fail, I'm just going to cry, so at least that'll make good content. Let's do it. No, stay away from me. Stay away from me. Oh my, wait, that works. There you go. Yeah, see, you stay right over there, bud. And then don't mind me. I'm just going to break out of here. Okay. If you're surprised that this is working so far, don't worry. I'm in the same boat as you. I'll just leave my water right there for you, buddy. Okay, good. It's pushing you back. Okay, I need to be very, very fast so he doesn't despawn. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. I have a lot of iron. Okay. Rail. Okay, let's go, go, go. You still here? Yes. Okay. Next up, you and I need to wait until nighttime. 
Oh, hey, would you look at that? It's now nighttime. Okay, so thank you for waiting, buddy old pal, oh friend. Chill, chill, chill. Okay, wait, wait. Okay, I need you. I need to get you the other way. So now I jump over you. We'll come over here. Boom, boom. And then let's go like boom, boom. Okay, I need to bridge faster than he can walk. Put you down there. Okay. So at least in here, he can't catch on fire. Oh, I know. I want to give you a huggy wuggy too. I know. I love you too. Okay, so now. Oh god, okay. I need to get him onto the rail. And then if we just come to his backside, not like that, and then we just go, wee! Please stop hurting me. Okay. I'm pretty satisfied with them being right here. Now we just go around and clean this up. I am genuinely shocked that this has actually worked so far in my favor. Ah, day 69. Why'd you chuckle at that? Okay, so our buddy's still here, which that's such a good thing. Aww, are you sure you don't want to hold anything? It'd make me a lot more comfortable if you would. Love you too. Okay, so one test I want to do where it's going to be kind of the same if I were to go into a different to mention but i want to run away from the base unload the chunks and then i want to see if he's still here i fully regret eating those apples from earlier on please apples apples Ugh. please tell me he's still there all righty and survey says Woo yes oh my god you're still here it worked oh honestly we might want to actually uh, tend to the farm for once nice everything is completely grown the main thing is that if i can actually get two villagers you know i can start breeding them however i'm going to need a lot of food for that wait can i breed villagers with only one block everything is looking golden we should probably do one test with that villager go to the nether and then just come straight back to see if he's still here let's go check on our boy are you still here buddy phew i'm coming for number two Hi, right, can you please drop that? Now, since last time it spawned in in the, uh, you know, that that one place with like the skeletons, the um, the Soul Valley. Yeah, that, that place. Maybe we just keep trying over there. And also this will allow me to get more bones, which I can then try. And, oh, okay. Oh, nice. So, okay, okay. Now, as I was saying, so I can keep on farming skeletons, get some more bones and see if we can actually grow some more trees, but... Uh, after trying 15 bone mail on that one tree, I don't know if we're going to uh, be able to fully grow them like that. So we might just have to get lucky with trees actually growing to get some apples. The worst part is that I've actually had two apples drop from the tree so far and I ate both of them. I was hungry. Hello, would any more zombified villagers like to spawn in over here? I didn't mean to shoot that. I'm still surprised I have not found a bastion or another fortress yet. Oh God. Oh no. No, that's not good. Oh, no more speed. No more speed. Zoom, zoom. That is a lot of brown and red mushrooms. Uh, you actually don't look like a bad spot to farm. I almost take that back because I am unbelievably far from the portal, though. <laughs> um, it might not be the most fun to bring a zombified villager all that way. I mean, just for another source of bone meal, it actually would be really smart. Okay, I'm still going to collect these, but I, I know the fastest way to get bone meal now other than skeletons. I need to go back to that warp forest. Oh god, don't, 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 don't. No, 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 stop it. Give me a chance. <gasps> okay, thank you. Okay, we need to get back now. <laughs> okay, I need to get out of here. Okay, I'm not gonna shoot you now. Can you not use him as a shield? Uh, that is so not fair. Okay, that's one down. I'm gonna chance it. Oh, I'm amazing. <laughs> Not today, stinky. Oh, I finally got a bow. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh. Okay, cool. So I just recorded the entire day of 71 and my recording software didn't work. Oh, what's that? I have no pants. Yeah, I actually made it to the very end of it. And then the skeleton shot me. I then made my way through here and I lit a hoglin on fire and then I killed it. And that's how I got my pork chops. Um, what I was talking about, about getting back to the warp forest is that these blocks are the best for making bone meal. And I think that was everything that happened. That's so cool. I love it whenever my recording software doesn't record oh hey would you look at that it's actually recording now okay so now that i don't have any armor down there whatsoever i can probably run around here and find some gold ore relatively fast i mean like i, I can always just go back to my base but i don't know this feels 
a bit more fun or kind of challenging. There you are. So like, that's just unfair. I know you're not alive, but that just shouldn't be allowed. No. Oh my God, I hate you. Oh, here, let me just spawn on a thin air right in your face and then start shooting you with TNT. Tee hee hoo hoo. Aren't I so fun and quirky? Okay, then if we run back this way a little bit ago, I placed down my crafting table right here. And then we can make ourselves some boots. We should probably go get some more gold just so I can make some pants. I saw a lot of gold down in this cave. There we go. And just like that, we have pants incredibly fast. Another is a terrifying place. The three baby amigos. Nice. Hey, guy. Hey, you want to trade? Wow. Uh -huh. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh my God. That's so much faster than a hoe. But anyways, back to the fun. So I need another area to actually get some zombified villagers. Oh, cool. Thank you, teammate. I love you. You're doing good. Oh, God. You're so scary. Stop resisting. So what we could probably do is here, follow me and I'll show you like a nice area. Oh, good, good. You're bringing all of your friends. For whatever reason, it just seems like Soul Sand Valley is the greatest a spot for zombified villagers to spawn in yep uh, we're gonna be here for a while buddies yeah Woo! i'm so excited and looking forward to this oh <laughs> uh, yeah can you please die thank you i really need to pick up this gold before a little booger comes by and picks it up you really don't need to be here at all i've changed my mind uh this area is not a good spot for farming whatsoever it's actually the the least greatest because of how annoying it is maybe if we go back over here where we were farming uh uh, the gold for our armor maybe around here so we're kind of close to that ledge in this area is like what i'm kind of worried about for them to you know just be stuck up there however we should be good like right here okay okay good so he jumped down from there okay so they do spawn up there but we should be good this should be a pretty high rate area okay so far not looking too good <laughs> Didn't think I would ever have this much of an issue with getting zombified piglin, like, do anything. Please go away! I'm so sick and tired of you. Now, given that I've done this on the past where I just don't attack them and I just keep on letting them pile up below me, I wanted to try it again. I would hit them here and there just to, um, I don't know, see if reinforcements would spawn in more, but I didn't see any correlation with that, so I didn't really do it that much. I also definitely didn't want to try this out just so I could play on my phone for a little bit. However, at the end of the day, I just got a massive group of fans right below me, so, you know, it wasn't the most eventful. <laughs> so, given that my luck while doing this strategy just is so incredibly high and it works so well, I did it today as well. And then at one point, I noticed that behind me there was some zombified piglin that spawned in, but so did one zombie. Now, it wasn't a zombified villager, you know, it wasn't anything that I needed, but it was cool. So I don't know. I thought I'd mention that to you. So I just wasn't feeling the spot. So I left and then I kind of barely traveled whatsoever until I got to this nice open area. I cleared out the floor just a little bit and then I started to build a staircase going up to this island because I noticed that every now and then zombified piglins would spawn up there. So I thought, okay, well, let me make them a staircase just so they don't get clogged up there. Once that was done, I got to farming, which it wasn't bad. I'd have to say this is probably the most successful area that I've been to. Huge hordes of them would come at times. I never really had to travel anywhere to get them. And also I just couldn't help it. So I did mine some of the gold or that I saw in here, but still no zombies of any type. So uh, still grinding. Practically the same thing today. The only notable things that actually happened, I had a baby zombified piglin spawning on a chicken. So I now have a feather and some uncooked chicken. So I guess that's cool. Uh, I got into a fight with a gas that was heavily annoying and I collected more gold, but so far still no zombie. And oh boy, man, was today uh, really disappointing. <laughs> so, it's not the easiest to explain about like what happened today, but it was basically nothing. I don't know how, but my nether is very barren. I almost found no enemies and there were just no reinforcements coming for the piglin whatsoever. And well, I did the exact same thing today. Nothing was really changing. I was luckily getting a lot more zombified piglin, but it was all hopeless, you know, there was no zombies again. And since it's getting so late in the movie and nothing has happened yet, I'm just, I, I might have to cheat. Is what I would have said if I was a loser. Almost immediately right on the edge, a zombified villager actually spawned in. We finally have the second 
won. So I did my little celebration and then I had to get to work. So very luckily for me, a magma cube spawned in and if it knocked me off, probably would have died or at least get severely hurt. So that was my main focus with my crossbow. Then after that, I was trying my absolute greatest to kill everything around the villager so that I wouldn't hit them, which I managed to actually do. So once I finally got rid of all of them and the babies, it's time to bring our friend home. Oh my goodness, do I have exciting stuff for you. We just have to make the journey all the way there. Uh, this is not gonna be fun. Yep, you're doing beautifully. Come on. Come on, boy. Put some pep in your step. Alrighty, buddy boy. Uh, in you go. And I have a friend for you on the other side. Please go smoothly like last time. Don't hurt me, don't hurt me, don't hurt me, don't hurt me. <laughs> Oh, get away from me. Okay, phew, barking worked. Okay, oh my god. Uh, you don't need that much space. Yeah, we'll just leave you right there, okay, buddy? And don't mind me, just need to break my way out. We might as well go and place the rails now. And then I want them relatively close with each other. So I think about here will be good. If I run that way, oh God, I might have to break through the ceiling. Huh. Now, while it turns nighttime. So here's why I wanted to collect all these nether warp blocks. We're gonna be getting a lot. <laughs> And well, that's all I did until nighttime. And then once I composted all of that, I ended up with 32 bone meal. Are you sure you don't wanna grow? Oh, you do? Okay, good, good. Oh God, okay, well, I'm gonna be really sad if I see an apple drop right there. Watch there be an apple from these leaves. Okay, good, it was just a sapling. Now I'm not so sad by that. Anyways, now it's time for the important part. Oh, you hoo Why, hello there, are you ready for- Oh my God, you move fast. Do I just like have to pick that up and then Maybe I put right there and then I do that. Ah, there we go. Okay. Oh, sweet. Didn't even hurt me. Okay, then please don't hurt me. Okay, there you go. Yep. Uh, enjoy fun time with your friend. Okay. Yep. I. So very luckily, I, I think I have enough gold to make some golden apples. I just noticed the ones in the bottom right corner. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now before we even do anything whatsoever, you know, before I even explain the future plans, I uh, <laughs> need to get some apples. <gasps> oh my gosh, yes. Yes, please, 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 please. <gasps> what? Oh my God. Okay, sweet. So um, I have two apples now. <laughs> Let's go and make our two golden apples. So now we can actually turn them back into villagers. And then this also probably isn't that important, but uh, we should probably go around and get all of the kelp. <laughs> Here's the bad part. Now, I kind of have a way to get a witch. However, we're on day 82, and if I were to do that, uh, there's no way I would be able to, you know, turn you guys into villagers in time. Uh, it would take way too long. You see, you can actually just bring zombies from the nether, trap them in water, make drowned, and then you kill the drowned enough to where you get copper, you get a copper, uh, not a copper rod, you make a lightning rod, and then you wait for rain to happen, and then you uh, make it electrify, or not electrify, but like strike one of them. I think while there's still zombified villagers out, you can still make them into a witch. I'm not too sure. Blah, blah, blah. It really doesn't matter what I'm saying right now. What does matter is that um I can't go that route, and if we want this movie to actually progress, I actually have to go into creative mode and give myself a witch spawn egg. But I'm gonna be honest, I think after going through and doing all of that legitly, you know, and enduring all of that, I think it's okay, you know, just to cheat this one time, you know, so, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, I... I just don't know what else to do because uh, for timing purposes, I can't do that legitly. Here's the witch spawn egg. I found it legitly. The one thing is I don't exactly know how to do this. If I at least had two blocks, you know, then I would kind of know what to do. Um, can you not hurt me, please? I, I, I just, I need to push you a little bit closer, a little bit, a little bit closer. Okay, just, just a little bit, a little bit more, one more. Okay. Yeah, I need to get these guys as close as possible. I, oh my God, I actually don't know how to do this. I think I know a way so I don't get killed. Okay, so this one right here should be where they are. Actually, here, we'll, we'll just pick up the water. We'll, we'll be safe. We'll, we'll be smart. Remove. <gasps> no, no. No. Oh my god. Okay. Uh never mind. No, we can't do that. 
Oh my god, my heart just dropped. I need to create an opening where a potion can fly through the floor and hit down here, but without the sun hitting them. Oh my god, okay, this is... <laughs> This is a lot more difficult than what I thought it was going to be. Well, I'm definitely awake now. Okay, can I open up you? Actually, yeah, this is easier. Okay, so I can break this one. How far can a witch throw a potion? Oh, but I need to be hitting the witch. I can shoot her. Okay, I need to go find out how far can a witch throw. Okay, so this should be interesting. Apparently, witches can throw potions within 10 blocks. So from here all the way down to there. I think this actually works. I don't think the witch will... I mean, just so we're safe, what we can do... I think the witch can still throw over this and then hit me down here, maybe? Oh my god, you're pushing them. Push you that direction. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, please let me go. Okay, there we go. Put water right there. Push them all the way down to that dirt block. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Oh my gosh, okay. I really hope this works. My only issue is that I think the witch will only throw the potion if I'm near it. I know the witch has to be very low on health to throw a potion of weakness, but I don't know if I need to be like right next to her or if I need to be all the way down here. Top of the morning, laddies. Let's just do this. Hey, what'd you just drink? Ow. Did that hit them? Oh, stop it. Okay, I'm not seeing any particle effects on them. That is really bad. <laughs> I need to move them back a block. Don't hurt me. And then send you back. I can just water elevator on up. Okay, perfect. And then I need to get rid of you. Oh, stop. I hit them. Okay, now... I just need to shoot you. Throw it. Not poison. What was that? Wait, that was a different color. Have I mentioned how much I hate you? No. Okay. That's awkward. Don't throw anything. Do not throw anything. Stop. What was that? What did you just throw? I'm hoping you can survive these. Um, I'm trying my best to not kill you, but I really need you to throw a potion of weakness on those two dudes right below me. Okay. Yep. Don't, don't shoot four times. Okay. Yep, I just, I had to make sure, but you know what? I, I know that for for certain now. Okay, so three it is. Okay, hi. Uh, don't worry, you're the first witch here. I've never seen another one before. So, one, two, three. Okay, now, can you throw a potion of weakness over here? Po potion, potion weakness. What was that? What, what was that one? Okay, you know what? I got one, two, three. That one was personal. I definitely hate you for that. Don't tell me that was weakness. I might be able to break this block because I think that the witch keeps hitting it. Please stop healing and throw it. No! Weakness! I hate you so much. We're gonna make this really fast. Can I break this and you don't catch on fire? Are you good down there? Okay, you know what? Stop throwing it. Come on. I know that was slowness. You can't fool me. Come on. Okay, I'm right in- <gasps> Oh my god, I accidentally clicked. Oh my god, I almost just killed the witch. Okay, please. Unless- <gasps> Yes, 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 yes. I don't need the witch anymore. Oh my gosh, I can do this and not feel bad about it whatsoever. Oh yeah, no, I am not going to make this quick for you. No, I don't like you. Okay, wait, wait stop, stop yelling. Okay, wait, 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 okay, thank you. Oh my gosh, oh, we are finally done. Hi, oh, you're both done. Why, hello there, yeah, welcome to the world. Oh my gosh, I was about to go play on my phone, so hi. Um, Both of you stay right there, okay? You're gonna have more fun in there. <laughs> I need to figure out a location for them. I am, um, you know what? We might just make this area the villager place. <laughs> okay, so if we do two trap doors and we put a half slab on top, I mean, it doesn't have to be one, but wow, I can actually go through them without even getting hurt. Replicate that right here. Uh, we're just gonna keep that closed just in case of uh, baby villagers spawn in. Okay, hopefully I don't hit you. Okay, good and good. Okay, well, um, you two enjoy your space right here. Okay, well, you guys can make out, but like, geez, you could have waited for me to leave. So on top of having a librarian, uh, a thing that I'm going to need drastically to actually make emerald so I could buy anything, I don't have paper. Okay, good. My beautiful doorway works. So now... Okay, let's just make six beds. How are we going to do this? <laughs> do bunk beds work for you guys? I don't think so. Okay, can I make the entire floor out of beds and you guys can actually, like, use them and stuff? Like, can you, can you step on it? I know, trust me. I'm, I'm learning stuff here as well. I've never had to uh, only use one block before. 
I should probably move you farther away from them because I have a feeling that they want to use you. Okay, are you going to come down here and use this? Okay, okay, you'll walk on the bed. Nice. Not the worst. Not the worst. Can I get better? I might actually take that. It's actually not that bad of a trade. Especially since I could just focus wheat. I honestly might change my entire farm into just potatoes. And then for you... Can you come over here, buddy? Alrighty, butthead, uh, what are you using? Wow. One emerald for that? That's, oh my God, only three for a bookshelf? Sheesh. Okay, I see the kind of trades that you, no, 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 no. Please turn around. Please turn around. Just go for the lectern. What else do you want? You want my bed? Is it the furnace? There's no way. Please don't tell me you want my furnace. Please, I'm cooking stuff. Oh my God, you finally went to it. Not the worst, honestly, just for one emerald and get that, but. Okay, so while we have to go through and do all of that fun stuff, can I get I Either of you to make a baby there's food right there huh huh doesn't that just look scrum diddly umptious to either one of you huh especially if you were to go backwards and get away from the door huh yeah yeah you want those carrots yeah buddy yeah now given how they've just taken over my second floor and i can't really place anything down or else they're just gonna camp at the doors again let's go make a house you know, i think i deserve that <laughs> Okay, so this should be high enough. And then let's go and create some more staircases. And then very likely, since it's already just so late into the movie, and I have a lot of wood. So now we could just, you know, spoil ourselves, put this oak log for the floor. And then, oh yes, yes, we need some perfect lighting. Okay, we should be far enough away from the little gremlin. Why is he staring at me? Look at him, just look away. Okay, we'll put our bed all the way in the back just to be safe. And then can I finally place down these without having to worry about them wanting to do anything? And uh, well, there's not really much else that you can actually do in a one block house. <laughs> It's so sad. We might actually have to go back into the nether to get some more uh, warp blocks. Ah, the nether. The place that I am so sick and tired of, but thankfully I do not need to be in here for long or have to deal with any of you. Nice. Okay, well... I was gonna say is uh, I just need to go after trees that are definitely going to break in one swing and oh my god that almost broke my axe off of one tree okay no not my axe I meant the tree well since I have so much wood I guess what I can do at the very least is just make a whole lot of wooden axes and then maybe this will go well wooden axes are surprisingly not that bad <laughs> so I believed I collect enough to you know get, get just a few bone meal you know I, I don't think I'm going to be suffering whatsoever from a lack of that so we should be able to make a lot of potatoes hopefully get the villagers going and having fun it's taking everything in my power to not shoot them hi uh, see i'm never going to miss having to do this every single time i want to come back from the nether don't get me wrong it's definitely fun total blast but man am i not going to miss it ah uh, and then don't mind me i'm just going to be in my bedroom for the next 50 days just right clicking on a composter and with this, we actually should be able to make a lot of potatoes, which should then make the villagers very, very happy. Okay, so now that the rain is gone and I can actually see everything, you know, just way more beautiful. Okay, so now that the rain is gone and it's actually bright outside and beautiful for us all to look at. So let's go up here. We're going to make some more potatoes, which not bad. We got like a stack and like one fourth of it. I, I don't think that they'll like that one, though which I honestly still don't know what the point of poisonous potatoes are. It'd be kind of nice if we could just put them in a composter. Anywho's, hello. Wow, you guys are actually like near each other for once. That's incredible. So anyways, uh, here's some potatoes. If you can make a child, that'd be really great. I'd like to cross that quest off. Please do something. Oh, wait, wait, sorry. I know you guys don't like it if I watch. They definitely have enough potatoes. Okay, so maybe you need like a block of space right there. Oh, <gasps> wait, wait. It might be an issue with the beds actually. Now, I okay, I just saw the heart, so I know it's possible for you guys. Okay, let me put a bed there, that bed there. We'll take up you. Honestly, I guess we could just leave it right here and then you guys will kind of hang out with each other. Okay, I saw the hearts. It has to be possible, right? Please do not make me bring you into the nether, please. Please. Is that a baby? Baby? Come on, you have enough. Oh my god, yes. Oh my god, yes. Oh my gosh, they actually had one. Oh my gosh, 
Yes. Oh my gosh. I don't need to bring them into the nether. Holy. Oh, okay. Good, good. So villagers can definitely have babies on a one block wide world. Oh my God. I thought I would have to bring them into the nether and then set up like a little base for them there because there would actually be room to move around. So it looks like the most important parts are just beds and then one block of space in between. Oh my gosh, that's a huge weight off of my shoulder. I can now cross a little villager uh, adventure off of my list. Holy, we actually completed that quest. Dear God, that was one of the most difficult challenges I've ever done in Minecraft. I'm just a little bummed about the witch and having to spawn in them to get this far, but oh my gosh. Let me move. You, what are you selling? Crosswalker in that one? No. I really need you to move. Okay. There you go. There's your job. There's your job block. Take it. Come on. You don't want to be a farmer. No, I don't need two farmers. Oh, oh God. It moves too. Oh, God. Terrifying. Oh, God. No. Let me out of here. No. Oh, okay. So you're finally done. So, yep. Got me a lot of kelp. And then since I don't... Oh, actually, no. Here. Carrots. Yes. Here we go. I don't need... Wait a second. Just in case if there's just, like any bizarre reason that I need these again. Okay. Here you go, boys. Yep. Enjoy those. Is there something you want to say to me? Are you... Oh, my God. He's actually just staring at me. Are you good? Jeez. What did I do? I literally made you. I brought you into this world. What? Actually, wait. What if we do go for like... I don't know. Uh, like, like, like a fish route you know i mean that was not bad look at the c1 even though it's only one book and then one. can you back up please thank you so that's actually going to be a lot more difficult though because i need you to sell a bookshelf and an enchanting book for that and you really seem to not want to do anything okay for the love of God, can you guys please move from the door? I can't even access it. Move. Be gone, Satan spawns. No. Oh my God. Go. Go away. There. There. Take that one. Stop trying to go to my home. I want to hit you. Um, close, but no. Uh, let me get through. <laughs> oh my gosh. I hate you. <laughs> And then I jump through. Yes, thank you. Don't make me hit you. Just do it. Okay, you know what? Here, uh, you guys enjoy that. I'm gonna go do something else. Uh, okay, wait, wait, wait. No, I, I, I know where my mine shaft is. It's right here. Here, here. Oh God, where did I? Was it back here? Ah, see, I told you I knew where it was. Yeah, there's my mine shaft. Oh, there we go. Perfect. See, I'm not lost. I know my own house. Okay, so since I don't exactly have you know that many days left don't really have that much time if i'm honest i don't really have anything else to do in the world <laughs> but i might as well just go like mining and fishing and oh my god you finally took the job and it's nothing that i need okay i'm kind of done with you guys but you know at least i i did oh <gasps> they had another one or is that the same one? Nope, that's a different one. I see the baby jumping right there. Okay, well, it's now two babies in there. So yeah, we're definitely done with the villagers. I'm happy with all of that. Completed that challenge that I made. And now I guess it's time to relax. I don't know, it feels weird to say that. And then day 93, I yearned for the mine, so I went back. The entire time, I just wanted to dig in a straight line. However, I kept finding that one really massive cave, regardless of how low I kept on going. So that was a tiny bit annoying, but then... And after a little bit, I managed to actually, you know, start mining and then a thunderstorm came. So apparently I just can't get rid of rain, but I did manage to find some gold when mining. So, you know, I got my PTSD from the nether back. And then today it was basically like I went into retirement. I just wanted to fish. Nothing too crazy happened except for I got a wooden crate. And once I opened that bad boy up, I got another crossbow. So I now have a fully repaired one, which is really cool if I was on like like day 20. <laughs> and then today I kind of felt like Thanos, you know, like after he uses all those infinity stones and then he goes to some planet and he's living in a hut. Yeah, I kind of felt like that. And it didn't capture anything special, but you know, it was very nice and relaxing. And now to not waste any time whatsoever, I just kept fishing, enjoying my time. Everything was really peaceful, you know? The villagers were enjoying it. All of the babies grew up. Retirement was looking really good on every single one of us. And then finally, after all of this time and making as many challenges as I could just to make this world 
last longer. It was day 99. And as soon as that sun went down, the challenge was finally over. Oh, oh man. Ah, oh, finally woke up. Ah, oh, and it's day 100. So there we go. I finally survived 100 days on a straight line. Oh my gosh, I made an iron farm. Oh, that's hilarious. Yo, thank you so much. Hey, do you have any other iron over here? Oh god, there's a lot of babies. No, wait. Now you're gonna drop your iron out there. No. Nice. Oh, okay. Yep. Nope. Didn't need it. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anyways, so I hope you all enjoyed the movie. I tried to make it as entertaining as possible. It's just, wow, it was really easy to get through like every single challenge. So that's why I wanted to do uh, the villager challenge, which that one definitely took forever, but it was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed that one. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed it, 300,000 likes and I will do 200 days on here. Yeah, it's not happening, but I hope you all enjoyed the movie and I will see you guys next time. See ya.